Hey guys, Dark Rain here. Welcome to Dark Rain Downtime. Now we're here with like most of the active crew. I, I think just about every Dark Rain member. And uh, Johnny was going to introduce everyone individually. So go ahead, Johnny. All right, here I go. First up, we have the original OG of COD himself, Dalton. Ooh, All right, next up, we have a man who's probably 80% vapor and 20% human. It's James. Yeah. <laughs> next up, we have the curly-headed PC gamer, Nathan. Hey. <laughs> that was awkward. <laughs> we have. <laughs> oh we have. <laughs> Shut up. Let me introduce Winter. <laughs> All right. We have the original mad rapper himself, Mr. Fizzy. I'm not a fucking rapper. <laughs> 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 and then we have your beloved person, Dark Green Gamer Matthew. You forgot. We also have Christian. Oh my god. Who's oh, okay. Psycho. God damn What the no. heck? <laughs> that was rude. Dude. That was rude. Oh, the disrespect. I forgot Psycho. It's because Psycho's What's quiet, but plan? he's just like. <laughs> I, I thought I'm you were sorry. supposed to be quiet because to everyone, like, presented their names or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. So, and, Psycho, you're chill, man. And I forgot because then everyone started laughing and I kind of just lost track of who I was on, so. Alright. Well, anyways, um, this technically is not the first episode of Dark Rain Downtime because we've done other ones before, but they're all really shitty. So, this is kind of like the reboot, you know? <laughs> this is the so, anyways. I'm in. Yeah. We're being so, during all that. By a pizza place to slip in there. No, we're not. <laughs> the pizza we rolls, Dad. Anyways, um, so in the pre-show, uh, we were going to find a topic to start with, but everyone kept fucking around, so we couldn't figure out which one to <laughs> start with. <laughs> so, I think we should go with, uh, basically, like, who's in the call right now, so catching up with Dalton and, uh, or not Dalton, sorry, uh, Nathan and James, because they haven't been here in a while. Mm. So a I guess we'll start with Nathan. Yeah, while. Uh, while. Nathan, where have you been? Yeah, Nathan, where have you been, man? What have you been up to? Uh, nothing much, really. I've been busy with, uh, school, mainly. And, mm. you know, girlfriend, uh... <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> last time I talked to you guys, I had a really bad, um... <clears throat> I had a really bad sleeping schedule, and I've been ca trying to catch up on sleep, and... I've... Sweet. I have insomnia as well. Ooh. And... Yeah. Welcome to the family. I think everyone in here has insomnia. Yeah. I do. Yeah. I just actually went to the doctors yesterday to go get that figured out. I need to go. It fucking sucks, dude. I need to get. I still need to get my pills and shit. But you yeah, know, I, I still gotta go. Go. dreams. When James was at my house the other day, um, I had a bunch of pill bottles on my desk, and I'm like, "This is breakfast. This is lunch, and this is dinner." <laughs> like, this is to keep me awake. This is to stay awake, and this is to go to sleep. <laughs> nice. It's terrible. But it's yeah, obviously been... an abused half life. <laughs> yeah. Runs his life on pills. Yep. <laughs> and white wine. <laughs> pills and white wine. White wine. It sounds like a fucking it sounds like a white mom right there, a soccer mom. Some oxy. <laughs> oh yeah. But right. yeah, I've been battling personal things as well, so you know that's yeah. that's been what's going on, man. That's good. Yeah. Good to hear. And you know what's crazy is like we got, what, six of us in here right now? Yeah. I don't think all six of us have got together in a long seven. time. Oh, how yeah. Seven. seven. Oh, seven. Keep forgetting oh, Psycho. Yeah. No, I'm forgetting myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Anyways. This is like a big family reunion. We haven't been together in such a long time. Yeah. So, James, how have you been? Where have you been? What's up? <laughs> well, I've been going to school and working. Mm -hmm. And pretty much mostly working most of the time. I don't really play video games that often anymore. But that's yeah. gonna change <laughs> soon. <laughs> and yeah, I'm hoping Friday. My little bit of addiction of vaping. Mm. I think okay, so I vape, James vapes, Johnny vapes, Winter vapes a little bit, Dalton vapes like when he's with us, and Psycho mm -hmm. smokes, and Nathan, I'm not sure. Nathan, do you Dude, do I, any vaping? I don't fucking do shit like Yeah. I mean, I've blown it, I've, I've just blown a bong once, and that was a uh... blown a bong. I thought it was hookah. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, dude, I blew it. It just went like all the way down my throat, and I drank the water as well. Oh god! Oh, I drank the water too. <laughs> what? It's loud. <laughs> to be honest, Shit. I've drank the water too. I've actually eaten weed. Yeah. So like, no. it gets you fucked up. I've never done that. Oh yeah, and I'm a medicinal smoker, so. 
Medicinal. Come on, Nathan. Nathan <laughs> if I ever do a Cali, I'm gonna track you down and we're getting high. Oh fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, according to my friends, I passed out on the floor, woke up screaming, I want chicken nuggets, dad! <laughs> <laughs> Alright then. <laughs> I, I don't even know, dude. Well, uh, was so James, you're supposed to be there? getting- No, he Are wasn't. They... What? Hold up. What, Matt? You're supposed to be getting an Xbox soon, right? Yeah, Friday or the next two weeks. Awesome. Memes, that would be great. Dude. Yeah. Nathan, you need to get an Xbox One, bro. I'm actually planning to get one. I, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm planning to get one. And Start prostituting yourself off? <laughs> no. Like, Shit, dude. If you guys are like, a I man, I pay for it for that booty. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, Nathan, you're, you're you're a fine piece of man at candy, you Excuse know? Me? Like, I'm sure somebody would pay money for you. Uh, probably Brianna, <laughs> but no one else. <laughs> oh, come on. If I pulled up on the street and you're sitting there, you, you'd hop in the car. <laughs> yeah. No thanks, fam. <laughs> Who is- oh wait, hold on. Who is- Who's doing that? Yeah. Everyone silence. What is that? Winter, I'll do it again. There yeah, are I know it's winter. who have guitars in here. And Winter! It's Winter and Nathan. Yeah. Wait, how do you even know I have a guitar? What the fuck? Bitch, we only Nathan, have a guitar. Because you've played it a bunch of times. Yeah. You played it in the mic. last Dark Rain downtime. I did? Mm hmm. I don't remember <laughs> that. Come on. I'm pretty sure you've posted things on Instagram about it. Oh, yeah, that, that's true. Follow me on really Instagram, really guys! I'm the only yeah, one John. here that cares enough about Nathan's life to follow him. Bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I really don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Alright, so... So we need another topic. Does someone want to pick one? Um, how about... The whole 2016... Oh yeah, that's my question. Um, yeah. how is everyone's 2016 going so far? I wanna kill myself. Lame. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's fucking um, edgy. Okay. <laughs> Uh, you need a therapist. Let's just the say first, that. Like, as soon as you ask the question, lame, and I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> I wanna kill myself. Like, whoa! You you went from all the way down here all the way to, like, fucking space, dude. Jesus. Oh, God. Anyways, well, I uh, lost. I lost a very oh, God, important you? professor in my life. Mother Teresa. Oh, really? Yeah. Did he, uh, Severus Snape is gone. Oh. In for I'll chop up the rest of uh. Isn't that Wait, a topic stop later? That? Oh my god! Wait, what's up? Yeah, stop with the with the, the yeah guitar the thingy. fucking guitar. So my oh, 2016 has been all right. I mean, I I was super behind in school and I caught up and I oh, passed yeah. all my classes. So yeah, dude. that's good. Yeah. I've been high. Don't nonstop. forget about your H1N1 addiction. It's Z1, H1, Z1, <laughs> piece of shit. Flu. H1, N1 Matt, is uh, a flu. Ah, whatever. H1, yeah. Z1, Daisy, all that's the same. <laughs> so it's a running joke. <laughs> Basically, um, when you, when would you guys say I started playing H1, Z1 and stopped playing with you guys? Like, forever. A Last couple year. About a year. Last, Last year on your birthday, when or on Christmas, when you got your computer. Yeah. Actually, know. no, it was, no, it was like. Whenever when you met Mark... your lover, Mark. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah, my, my wife. <laughs> Yeah, my wife beat her friend Mark. Uh, that's probably like two months ago. So, anyways, I started getting back into H1Z1. And I just kind of dipped off from Xbox, and uh, I've just been playing that like the entire time. For those of you who don't know, um, H1Z1 is like a survival H1. MMO RPG, and it's a computer game. It's yeah, you posted really a fun. shit ton of videos on it. Yeah, kinda. I mean, I would record more of it, but like, I don't have like a top like top of the line computer, so it's not gonna look as good as it would if I was on a console. What graphics so. card do you have, by the way? I never really. Um, never really mine heard. is a GTX 750. Oh, I have a 950, which is like yeah. a bit better. Ooh. Like, I was gonna overclock mine, but I was scared that I was gonna like fuck my computer up. So overclocking isn't yeah. gonna fuck it up. It's just like it's yeah. it's. Uh, I'm not gonna say it's risky. <laughs> it's just like it's scary when you first do it. Computer. Yeah. Well, basically, um, I was watching videos on how to do it, and there's, like, you can do it through the BIOS, you can do it through, um, com uh, system, like, programs on your computer, or, um, if you're, like, three, if, if you have a computer that's, like, 300 fucking years old, you can turn the actual clock backwards, but that's not a thing anymore, like, that's not on graphics cards, or graphic cards anymore, so, I'd have to figure out how to do it in the BIOS menu, which would be scary. <laughs> yeah, that's, it's really scary. I overclocked my, uh, 950. Oh, well. How much are uh, so you have sixteen gigabytes of RAM? I have eight. <clears throat> eight. Oh, okay. I thought you had sixteen for some reason. 
Uh, no. I, I might be upgrading I... to 16, but I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, all, I just, I'm starting to run out of uh, hard drive space, so I'm going to have to get uh, another, like, terabyte or two. I have two terabytes right now, and I have 8 gigabytes of RAM, it's just my processor just can't keep up with, like, actually what's being put out, so... Yeah, I'm looking, I kind of want to get a, a new computer, and if I did, I'd probably just take this computer and use it for, like, video editing or something. Like you did with your uh, old school computer? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That, yeah. <laughs> I don't, I don't know if I would, like, because I kind yeah, I could probably get a, a little bit of money if I sold it, but it wouldn't be, like, the same as having two good computers, you know? Yeah, yeah, definitely. So. Yeah, what were we talking about? Oh, yeah, 2016. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He just got completely off got subject. Into that topic. Yeah, so, um, Psycho, you said your 2016's been lame. <laughs> yeah, um, you know, just basically the same shit in school. Um, nothing really new in games that came out. Um, I'm still waiting on for Black Ops 3's DLC content to come out, which oh, yeah. should be... Psycho, like I'll be playing with you. Yeah, it's oh, yeah. next month. I'll be playing with you because I got the season pass. Wait, season um, pass for what? I'm planning on getting it for Black Ops Black 3. Ops 3. Yeah, uh, Nathan, I don't know if you know this, but if you get the season pass, you get to play the giant, which is basically uh, Dare Eyes from World at War. Dare Oh, shit. Dare Reese. What? Well, Dare Eyes. It's, it's Dare Reese. It. It's not. It's, if you're saying, like, Reese's Pieces, like, it doesn't matter. <laughs> you, I, I, I call, call you Matt pass. and not Mate. That, yeah. There's a difference. I call him Mate. Matty Moo. Matty Moo. <laughs> I started yeah, that! Hard. I started that! He did. <laughs> Winner, yeah, you called me Maddie Moo one time in the chat. They're like, oh god. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I call Winner, like, I call him Coon or I call him Wiener. Um, Dalton's like Dolphin or Dalton. I get called Johnny's Daddy. Daddy. I, call, I call him Ralton. That's the yeah. <laughs> My friends oh, have, like, a running joke that they call me Daddy and it's fucking annoying as shit. Oh. Yeah. It's, no, Daddy. It's not okay. No, stop. Please. <laughs> Daddy. I call you Daddy. Deeper, Daddy, Daddy deeper. come revive me. <laughs> <laughs> you of all people so, know that winner. Dalton, Dalton, we haven't even, like, yeah, Fuck you're, like, yeah. a main part of this shit, and you haven't even spoke that much. Okay. He died. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, <one's> dead. <laughs> he died. I guess, he died. Yeah, I guess we'll hear from, uh, Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> we scared him away, guys. Yeah. It was uh, too scary. Go. Oh, um, we should probably move on to our next Dalton? topic. Johnny didn't even say how my 2016 is going. Yeah. Um. It's all right. Like I've been working a shit ton, making bank. Making bank. Um. I'm yeah, that's one up, thing. Trying to everyone in out this of my call own house and into an apartment. <clears throat> yeah, that'd be cool. But yeah. like, I think so. Dalton's got a job. Johnny's got a job, and so does James. Uh, me, Nathan, and, and as far as I know, Psycho. I'm gonna start winter. working soon. Yeah. I'm actually planning to work soon. Yeah, we're jobless hobos better. right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I'm, I'm, I'm planning on starting to work because I need to, I still need to get my license and everything. Yeah. Wait, you didn't even have your permit? Alright, learner's permit yet? Uh, no, I have my learner's permit. I, well, oh, okay. I just need to get my license and a car. Alright, cool. That's awesome. So, yeah, I guess we'll move on to our next topic. Dalton was actually supposed to talk about this one, but I guess I will. Um, so we're looking for like new members to like add into the Dark Rain family. Like, Definitely. so basically like, yeah, like every couple of years we add a member and it's not because like we're looking for members. It's cause it just happens. Like first it was me and Dalton and we found James cause James is family. And then, uh, we eventually came across, I think it was Psycho, uh, playing Black Ops 2. Oh gee. Then we came across. Die Rise. Yeah, yeah Die Rise. And then we came across Winter playing Black Ops 2 as well. So, I mean. Members just kind of pop up every now and then, and we're actually looking for a couple more just so we have like a fuller family, you know. Like just seven of us is kind of sad. Do you guys remember how I met you? <laughs> yeah, I do. Um, I think we, I think, had, I think we had like a whole fucking like Minecraft episode of us just talking about it. I think yeah, I was gonna say if I th if I remember correctly, I was playing Fallout New Vegas. And you and Winter were playing Battlefield. Yeah. And he, you kept joining the party, and we kept kicking it out because we didn't like you. <laughs> yeah, and you're just like screaming insults at me. I remember that. Yeah, I don't remember how we became friends, but I know that's how I met you. I joined you guys' uh, Grand Theft Auto Five game, and we just, uh, I joined you guys' yeah. party, and we just started talking. Ah, uh, okay. Just, <laughs> Matt, I think you just have a habit of not liking anyone when you first meet them. Yeah, you didn't Johnny, like I, me either yeah. right off the back. I hated Johnny. I love Psycho right off the bat. Everyone, Everyone loves Psycho. Loves Psycho. He <laughs> loved me. Yeah, I did love Winner right off the bat. He was hilarious. I liked Winner. At first. I feel like I'm the only one who was really hated. 
Matt, no, Johnny was hated. Uh, I didn't, didn't like yeah. Me. When we were doing, so we met Johnny by doing roleplay uh, videos, and like he was a friend of a friend. And when I first met Johnny, I was like, this guy is obnoxious. He doesn't know I what he's doing. I was very talkative. <laughs> he's like, yeah, he's, he doesn't know what he's doing. He's a cocky asshole. I don't like him. So, like, in the next episode, I didn't want him in there. But eventually, I guess we added him or something because we didn't have enough people. <laughs> nice. Yeah. And good they job. added me, and then it actually turned out being pretty good. Yeah. Nice. I still fucking hate you. Okay. No, <laughs> no, you love me. Of course the I love you. There. How could I ever hate you? Oh. <laughs> He's like, you know, winner. I enjoy all your guys' company. What the yeah. fuck? <laughs> psycho. Thank you, Psycho. You said it in a non gay way. <laughs> Anal. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Who said that? Anal vomit barbecue. Anal. Jesus, are you into that shit, man? What the fuck? Yeah, mm. I cooked some oh, nice ass if you want it. Uh. But, uh, yeah, back to the. <laughs> back to <laughs> Oh my god. Wait, what? <laughs> Oh, God. Back Sorry, to um, adding new members to Dark Rain. So actually, if um, like, like, are we gonna oh, go ask for people to put their gamer tags or whatever in the yeah. comment section? Yeah, exactly. So if you would like to join Dark Rain, like our clan, not just the videos, but our clan, um, put your like. <laughs> okay, <winner's> dying. <laughs> put your gamer tag in the description and put mouth. like, uh, like make sure you like tell us that you want to join and you're the yeah. your gamer tag. I think that's pretty much it. Well, I there's mean, a signer's I, fee of, like, smoke. 5 to oh, $10. Dollars. God damn yeah. it, Johnny. Shut the fuck up. And <laughs> a, like, Dark Rain <laughs> join fee this. of, like, 30 Um, so, uh, Psycho. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, oh. there was another thing about the joining the crew or something <laughs> that you had on your list. I Isn't did. there? I think so. Oh, oh that, that ah. must have been Dalton's. Was no, it Dalton's? No, it was Johnny's. It was Johnny's. On yeah. whose list? About what? Recruiting for Dark Rain? No. Uh, no, yeah, it was Psycho's. Um, asked... His very last one. Psycho's asked, very last um, one. If you guys are open to the idea of uh, having a fan into our clan, um, Ooh, yeah, why so why not? Yeah, okay, so I would say yes for the straight fact that we do need some more members. Like, we're, we're seven of us. It's kind of sad. Like, we're supposed to be a clan, and I think to be a clan, you, like, need ten members in my eyes. And, yeah, I, I'd say yes. Anyone else? <laughs> I mean, I don't really have much of an input since I'm not really a, much a part of this as as much as I yeah. used to. But um, I'm just going to say my input anyways. I would say no, but, you know, there's two, there's there, there's leaders. But the main reason for that, you never know the person. And they could, you know, like, yeah, in the very beginning, they're going to probably be fangirling and, like, going crazy because, like, <laughs> they're huge fans and everything. But, like, I don't know. I just feel like it doesn't... It, Yes, fans can become really good friends of yours because, like, I was a fan of Matt and we became really good friends. So I wasn't, I wasn't really fangirling over it. And you know, those members can actually act really immature and just, sure. they could probably do something that could damage the whole entire crew. So yeah. you, you never know. It, it, it's always really um, hard for me to accept like new people into a group because you never know what they could do and that could damage multiple people. Yeah, and their well, it. It goes back to like that schoolyard crap where it's like, oh, he said this about you, or he doesn't like you, like that that bullshit. I could see that happening, like a new member trying to like pull everyone apart. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Or yeah, like he could try to take try taking you out personally, Matt, and just yeah. you and just being with you and trying to get, you know be your friend and like try to yeah because you know you have the biggest YouTube channel here, so and humble. Humbly. <laughs> know, to be honest, you could get those like those children who just want everything and are so excited and just mm -hmm. don't know what they're doing and just fuck up. And then we can get those guys that, to be honest, that me and Matt played with today that he immediately met us and didn't freak out about it. He was just like, "You guys mm -hmm. want to play and all this crap?" And he yeah just hung yeah, like, out we with met us a... on a call today. And it was it wasn't yeah. that bad. We met a oh, so we were recruiting for uh, Life in Los Santos and we met a cool guy and uh. Yeah, he, I mean, he's cool. His name is, like, Jacob, I think. And uh, he, like, showed us his yacht and stuff for in GTA. And since me and Johnny don't have a yacht, we're like, ooh, you know, like a yacht. And the guy sounded pretty cool. I think we're definitely going to have him as a main character. Nice, yeah. nice, real nice, nice, man. Nice. Does anyone yeah. else have, like, an opinion on it? On it? Dalton. Uh, I don't really care. Dalton isn't what here. He's <laughs> dead, dude. Yeah. He killed himself. <laughs> that's, that's dark. That, that was depressing. Damn, dude. <laughs> Dolls just fucking die. 
Dad. He dug his grave. Oh, oh my god, James, your mic just went like really bad for a second. <laughs> Hold on. What's this say? Yeah, it says you need oh. to like update Skype. There's like a little um triangle underneath your name and it says you need to update Skype or something like that. The fuck man? Where? Oh, there it goes. Now it's good. <laughs> oh, I was off of Skype. I was, oh, on my, okay. I was on kick. Oh, okay, yeah. I think if you stay on Skype, it stays good. But anyways, um, next topic is going to be Thank vaping. You. Now, um, like I th like I said before, uh, most of us in here vape. <coughs> so, um, well, you used to, have... if you guys remember that. Yeah, a little bit. Did you? Yeah, I had one, but it, oh, I lost okay. it during the move. Ah. Yeah, so James was kind of like the the father of vaping and i know i'm not saying that he's the master J or johnny because you guys have like a pissing match every time this happens <laughs> <laughs> but yeah james knows a lot about it and so does johnny granted so i don't know james can you tell us about your mod uh what do you want to know about it like really <laughs> what kind of well, what kind of mod in it what kind of batteries it do you have in it what kind of uh build are you running on your rda oh, okay yeah i got that all right i'm running what's an IP rda huh an RDA is like a rebuildable um, rebuildable, atomizer. rebuildable dripping atomizer. Atomizer, yep. yeah. Okay, I'm running the I IPv4 with the Lush RDA with 25R Samsung 25R batteries. Ooh, and I Samsung got a, batteries are good. I got a six wrap parallels 24 gauge, and I'm dripping goon juice. Goon juice. <laughs> goon juice. That's nice. Nice. What is goon juice, man? Yeah, I know. <laughs> they always make weird ass names for like weed <laughs> and then uh, vape juice. This is called I... Devil's Butthole. You want to take a hit? <laughs> I don't know. I currently have. Where is my little guy at? This is called suicidal tendencies. <laughs> Twelve people who are afraid to die. That's copyright. Fuck here. that band. Sat there. But no, I have my my little tie over mod until I get my uh, Hexome V2 or V3, which I'm not sure about which one to get. I'm probably gonna go towards the V2 because I like it and I've heard a lot of good things about it. So, main creator um, of that mod, you know. Well, Johnny, don't you, Johnny? You have a Hellboy right now, don't you? Uh, I have a Hellboy RDA. The yeah. mod that I have is my. It's the same company, El Diablo, but it's the Hellhound. Yeah, it's kind of it, it awkward. Was, yeah, because it's like it's basically just like a fucking a tube, but it's well, box. That, that's all. It's I was like gonna a, say that's all mechanical mods. So it's weird. Yeah, it's a mechanical. Well, that, and then my next, the one I was originally gonna get was it's called Castigador, and it's a little tiny one. It's like about the size of a box of cigarettes, and it's a dual eighteen six fifty mechanical mm -hmm. box. And the that one mechanical? I have right now is just a single mm -hmm. eighteen six fifty, but it has like. Um, what does this bitch have? It has like a high grade solid copper like frame, like gold, uh, plated bottom, top, contacts, all that shit. Um, I don't know. This is the first time I've had a Hellboy. Like I've wanted one, and I love it. Honestly, I love the whole fucking like when you twist and it does the airflow thing on the side of it. I fucking love that. Yeah. Yeah, I gave Matt my old Hellboy. Yeah, um, so James actually hooked me up, so I went, I was using, like, uh, pens, like, Ego Chaser pens and stuff like that, mm -hmm. and then, um, James had gave me, like, a mechanical mod, but he didn't give me an RDA, and the next time I came over to do, um, stuff, uh, <laughs> he gave me an RDA, which was the Hellboy, and, uh, I love the Hellboy, it's great, but I don't know if it's just me not liking mechanical mods, but even when I put it on my box mod, which is a Anakin I taste. MP, wait, wait, no, hold on. Anakin I Taste MVP 3.0 Pro. <laughs> it's a fucking long ass name. But I put it on my box mod, and it just doesn't give the same output as it did on the mechanical one, which doesn't make sense. So, I don't know. I'm not really into RDAs anymore because, like, I feel like they don't give you as much smoke as, like, a uh, tank does. Like, I have a tank right now, and it works beautifully. Every time, anytime I want it, I just hit the button and it goes, you know. With the RDA, you have to build. You have to put like a nice build on it to get it to produce that much smoke. So, yeah, you gotta know. you gotta understand Ohm's law and all that. It yeah. took me like a good few months to understand those. So. I don't know a clue about it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I was I was thinking about getting um. They're called a cherry bomber, and it's like a. It's basically a dual eighteen six fifty battery. Like I think it's they're a, parallel. Yeah. 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 They're, they're parallel. parallel. It's. 
Yeah, it's a Cherry Bomber bombers. parallel one, and I don't like that. I don't like the parallel, but I do like the design of it. So, I don't know. I heard that parallels get sketchy as shit, and for those of you who don't know what parallel means, it's when you have, like, two batteries and you put them in your controller or something like that, the A goes to the uh, minus and the minus goes to the A, right? They go sideways. Hey, yeah, and, guys, uh, I, I gotta go for a little bit. I have to walk my dog. All right, man. Sorry. <laughs> walk your dog at 7 at night? What the fuck? Yeah, my dog is going crazy, and I need to walk him. All right, man. Put him on well, we'll see you later. It's nice having you here. He's coming back. He's just well, gonna I'm gonna be back. It's off. gonna take a te like five oh. minutes. Oh, okay. It's chill. Well, yeah. Then you're just leaving like Dalton. <laughs> I'll be back soon. Died. You committed right, suicide. Die. You committed yeah. suicide. <laughs> be back. So, anyways, like I was saying, uh, parallel mods are really dangerous because you're running way too much current up and down. Like I don't, I don't know. Batteries just shouldn't work like that. And everyone says that every time they have a parallel mod, it fucks up, it like shocks them, it blows up in their hands, it does something crazy that it's not <laughs> supposed to do. So, <laughs> oh, what a parallel, un unchipped parallel box is it's nine volts going straight to the RDA. Yeah. It's way too much power. And you have to have a really hot build in there, or else it melts the build and just fucking shocks you. Yep. Uh, what do you call it? My brother in law, Jacob, he has a wonder, no, I think it's a clone of a Chayu mod. A Chi And, uh, no, nah, it's I think it's Chayu. Mm. Anyways, <laughs> it's a mechanical black Chayu mod or Chiyu, whatever, however you want to say it. And every time you hit his button, it shocks the shit out of you for some reason. And I think it's because his spring that he put in there is like um, conducting or something like that, because it hurts. Like you can't even hit his like yeah. mod without getting shocked. Now he's yeah. running the smock tank I gave him. Yeah. Oh, I like that tank because of the uh, the double air intake. So basically, like, you take in a hit from your mod, and it's it, the smoke's going to come out really hot, but he has, like, a double air intake, which is on the tip, and it basically feeds in cold air while you're sucking in the hot vapor juice, and or hot vapor, and it, it just feels amazing. It's really yeah, nice. Hot vapor juice. Uh, hot vapor juice. Yeah. Oh my God. I, I know Winter. What does Winter have? Uh, Winter has this little eye leaf. It's I taste. It's an Inican I taste. It's like an I MV, taste E leaf. I think it's MV two or some shit like that. MV. Yeah, winner's got. Yeah, winner's got a cute little mod. It's adorable. It's the same one I got from well, my it's mom. Well, a beginner's and, mod. Yeah, I got it from my mom because she's trying to get her to quit or quit smoking cigarettes, and I got it from my aunt, my grandpa, my grandma. Like everyone's got one now. <laughs> but to be honest, it's not like a bad beginner's mod. It's actually a pretty no. good one. No, it was it's one better of the than ones a, I had. Yeah, it's better than like one of those stick ones that everyone has. Hmm. James, what's the proper name for those? The, like the stick ones or whatever? The Egos. Egos, there you go. Yeah. Like an Ego battery. It's I don't like it, those at all. Call them Ego pins is what I call them. Nah. Hookah pins, all that shit. Hookah, yeah. Hookah pins. Yeah, I heard that you can like smoke hookah through like a... It's almost like a torch pin. That just seems yeah. sketchy and nasty. Well, they that. have think... vaporizers for herbs, so you could kind of just put shit in that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Trust me, I have so, one of those. <laughs> yeah. I want the Snoop Dogg ego pen. Yeah. <laughs> I got a dab big and I got a herb. Uh, herb. Yeah. Um, I know Psycho doesn't have a vape. Psycho smokes. Yeah. Yeah. Smokes with nasty things. But, um... <laughs> Uh, actually, wasn't the the question like if it's bad or whatever? Oh well, yeah, that was bad. yeah. That was yeah, my question. Vapor. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people have been saying like in the media, especially like on uh, Reddit and stuff, they've been saying that vaping's bad for you because um okay say so, so if you buy like pre wrapped coils, they come in like little packages. Um, like ninety nine percent of the time, they're sprayed with this uh type of chemical that makes them not spring up, so they stay in this tight little compact form. Yeah, and. Yeah, when you burn that into, like, a fresh wick and fresh juice, it tastes terrible and it's really bad for you. Yeah, and um, then people who don't know what they're doing are fucking stupid. Like, I've mm -hmm. heard stories of people just using any old type of cotton yep. in their vapes. Like, they'll use the fucking, uh, what is it, the, the bleach, cotton, cotton from pill bottles? Mm -hmm. Bleach from cotton. Pill bottles, and they don't fucking realize that that shit's bleach. Night mother, I'm recording, so... <laughs> They'll get sick from it and all that crap. Like, I buy, like, 100%, like, pure, organic, like, Japanese cotton, and that's what I use. Mm -hmm. And fucking, no, but you hear all this shit, and then, what is it? And then I was reading, like, people were like, oh, like, uh, you always see vapors coughing and everything and all that shit. But no, it's only when you start, 
like if you were a smoker before you start vaping then you're gonna cough a lot because it's not like a bad yeah. cough the vapor like when you're vaping and you've been smoking for years it fucking it clears out your system yeah, it even clogs all the... Like, yeah, most people don't know, that, but they've been using glycerin, like the actual ingredient glycerin, in hospitals since, like, the 50s. So it's not bad to inhale or to, like, vaporize. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, people get that twisted up a lot. It's yeah. fucking vegetable glycerin. It's not bad. Yeah. Vegetable glycerin, propylene glycol, and then flavoring, and sometimes nicotine yeah. if you want. Yeah, it's the um, same fucking flavoring you use for, like, cakes and cupcakes and yeah. all that crap. James and Johnny, I know you guys know this, but if you've, I, I don't, okay, so if you buy like a shitty juice, like a five dollar like ten gas milliliter bottle juice. of juice, yeah, gas station juice, you yeah. can taste it. You can taste that it's not been sitting long, and it it tastes bad. It mm-hmm. it almost feels like a like a cigarette or something. Mm-hmm. But when you buy like one of those twenty dollar bottles of juice, but that have aged for like a year, it it's insane. It tastes so good. It's literally I like eating the. Uh, I only drip. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it tastes like a like a candy or a fruit. Like you're like smoking like apple mint cinnamon pie or something like Would that. You mind like it tastes like that. Link for some of these juices. Yeah. Wonder they're like twenty bucks each, but yeah. I don't give a fuck. Will. Matt, did you try that uh, space jam? I space gave you jam? Yesterday? No, I haven't. I could right now. I could put it up in my tank. I need to clean this out. Okay. But yeah, I don't know. Um, everyone like I heard a lot of people getting pneumonia from smoking too much. Uh, I'm not you sure. have to be out in the cold, vape out in the cold, and it can give you. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah cuz I yeah, a lot of people are like, "Oh, vaping gives you pneumonia." And I was like, "Hmm, I don't know if that's true." Yeah, no, it's stupid as fuck. But just it's like really light chance of getting it. <clears throat> yeah. It's like if you're going to vape and you get one of the like ego pens and you've been a smoker and you're just like, "Oh, you know, I'm going to quit smoking, so I do nicotine and all that crap." Mm-hmm. Like it's fine on an ego pen if you try to use high things with nicotine <laughs> on a drip you're gonna die <laughs> yeah james he normally has about like I, I run three or five spots. milligrams Both yeah there. uh my uncle jimmy which is dalton's dad um he smokes like 32 milligram like uh nicotine yeah. like vapor juice it's, and it's it, it yeah it's, it's a huge it'll kill difference you. from an ego pen to a dripper <laughs> Yeah, it'll hit you like a shotgun in the throat. It tastes terrible. Like if you start and you use like 24 milligram like yeah. fucking nicotine or whatever on an ego pen and you try mm-hmm. to use it on a drip, you're going to fucking kill yourself. Yeah, not, it's like, not going to taste good. It's just, it's going to burn. It's going to hurt. Like you're going to cough. Mm-hmm. It's just. Yeah, I think I told James <laughs> about this um, when I first got my box mod. Um, I pulled it out of the box. I'm like, yeah, let's get this going. So I put my RDA on there. I put a new build on there. It was like a six coil wrap of 18, mili- or 18 gauge wire, like six wraps and some, uh, Japanese cotton. And I forgot what juice I was using, but anyways, I was trying to figure out what settings to put it at. So I Googled it. Everyone said do like, um, 30 Watts. So I started out at 30 Watts and it was going good. Like it, it tasted kind of burnt. So I kept ramping it down. And I was just hitting it out of nowhere, and it spiked up to 60, and it burnt the shit out of my mouth. Like, everything for a week just tasted terrible. So now now I only run, uh, what is it called? Voltage mode. Voltage mode, yes. I do not go into uh, wattage anymore because of that one time it burnt the shit out of me. So, yeah. Well, you did yeah. it at what? 60? Okay. Yeah, so I was running it at, like, 26 or something like that, 26 watts, and then it jumped up to 60. I don't know how, but it did, and it burnt the fuck out of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> and it, I think it ruined my uh, Hellboy a little bit because James said when he came over, it was not hitting like it's supposed to. So. Yeah, the center, the pipe, the peak inside the insulator in the middle was melted. Yeah. I think it just hit too hard. Yeah, like I said, now it just doesn't really hit the same as it did. So, when are, you said uh, you put a picture in the chat early and you said you blew out your fucking mod. Like, what happened with that? Uh, coil. I got it. Yeah, the coil. I got oh, it. Coil. In the mail, Ooh, gosh. and since when I opened it, this is the one that Jim said to put it inside. It was already in there, and apparently the people who actually shipped it to me fucked with it, and now it doesn't work. Hmm. Where'd they, you they, buy it they from? It came with two, so I'm using the other one. Okay. Which coil is that? It is a. I check, but I don't know how. Probably three. I, I just don't want to open it because of all the juices. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so are you running a like a small atomizer or like one of the 3.5 connections, like the big ones? Basically what I'm asking is, are you using the adapter that it came with or are you using the straight uh, box mod with your atomizer? I'm not using the one it came with. Okay, so yeah, you have like, you have a good tank then, I, I'm assuming. Yeah. 
Okay. Yeah, Kanger Tech's mm-hmm. tanks are pretty yeah. good. Ah, so. oh, Kanger Tech, okay. Yeah, yeah that's what he got. Now. <clears throat> okay, those aren't bad. Hold on, what is the... Cool. They're pretty good. So, oh, someone... Yeah. Does someone want to pick another topic? What exactly yeah. is it? Oh, he's got Can a... Can I pick one? Sub-tank Nano. Oh, <laughs> I know what Winter's talking about. I could pick one right now. Winter stick uh, rap. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> Why don't let's something. rap. How about <laughs> no, 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 no. bring no. back? Let's no? let's wait for like no, when we get the other two back in here for winter sick okay. raps. Yeah. All right, so I'm how about doing should, it? Should yes, call, you are. Should Call of Duty bring back older wars into their games? Ooh. Well, um, um, from what I heard from uh, my brother-in-law uh, Jacob, he said that they had like a scene in uh, the Black Ops Three campaign that had like a World War Two uh, mission. And I don't know. I think, I think they should, but I don't think it's gonna I sell like Black Ops Three would. God damn it! Dude, I just, what? I, I honestly think it'll look really good on the next gen consoles. So. Oh, it yeah. I any agree. game that Call of Duty produces is gonna look good, except for older. Like when they put it on a new gen and an old gen console, it it looks. I want to do the Dark Rain Manor. The Dark Rain Manor. Yeah, cause I'm making this mean? happen. I don't give a fuck oh. how I'm gonna do it, but I'm gonna do it. Hold on, wait for that. The tickets are moving in with me. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, whoa, no, no, no. <laughs> Hold on. Dark Rain Manor is for when Dalton. <clears throat> Fine, I'll wait for Dalton. Anyone who's right. Dalton? Right. Um, yeah. Oh, by the way, back about in your sec. COD subject, the since that they switched to PlayStation, they've been getting fucking hacked a lot. Yeah. And they they've been getting that de- shit. They, yeah, they've been getting DDoSed and hacked a lot. Yeah, it's fucking but, ridiculous. Yeah, I think um, them adding, like, definitely no, like, muskets or fucking bayonets or shit like that. Like, no muskets. Nothing past, like, World War One. But anything after World War One, like, you know, World War Two and, like, uh, the Vietnam War, Vietnam. maybe even the Iraq Korea. War. Yeah, Korea. <laughs> Grandpa. Um, he doesn't have a yeah. butthole. If they did, like... If they revamped, like they did a, a newer version of Call of Duty World at War, I would be all over it. But I, I just don't think it's going to sell like a Black Ops 3 would, honestly. Because I think more people are more people are interested in like futuristic stuff than they are about what's already happened. Like what, a game that they've already played before. So, I don't but know. But it, it would appeal to um, past COD. Old school. Yeah, like the veterans of COD. Yeah. Like shit, I think everyone in here has been playing since Call of Duty 4, except for maybe Winter. No, I've been playing since Call of Duty 4. Oh, you have? Okay, yeah. I just, so, I don't remember it because, you know, it was a shitty game to me. Fucking, Dude, I, I hated it. I love it. When COD 4 first came out, um, I think Dalton had a PS3. I went over to his house and I played it with him. That game was, like, insane. Like, for me, it was, like, game-changing. I was like, oh, my God, this is Dude, what, like, gaming I was is. so bad at that game. It pissed me off <laughs> so much. Like, Dude. And plus, I got fucking sold out on that bullshit. I, I <laughs> wanted um, World at War. And since it was, you know, kind of new at the time, and it was like 60 bucks, my mom was like, oh, you're not going to get that. Yeah, Fucking you're going to get the one that came else. before it. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, Dalton has always been good at Call of Duties. So, like, he was a beast in Call of Duty 4, MW2, World at War. Just all every single Call of Duty that has ever been, he's been good at. Like, it's insane. <laughs> Crazy. Yeah. I think I'm getting Echo. Hello? Hello? Yeah, we're getting Echo from you, I think. Uh, James. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, Johnny, did you play Call of Duty 4? Uh, yeah. I played... What is it? I played all... I, I played from World at War to... Now. I think the only one that I didn't play all the way was the first Modern Warfare. <laughs> did you know that Johnny <clears throat> did a 1v1 with Dalton? <laughs> and he got zero kills? Oh, <laughs> when are <Yeah. laughs> when are you want to know something cool? <laughs> we played uh, World at War. Actually, no, it was Advanced Warfare. Sorry, um, last year. Yeah. Or no, it was the year before that. And me and Dalton one v or two v two Psycho and uh, Winner. And no offense, Psycho, and maybe a little bit of offense to Winner, but we like we crushed you guys. <laughs> and also, like when Winner kept calling me yeah. a Christmas noob, and then we one v one, and then I kicked your ass. Ooh. It's still kind of funny because you couldn't get any kills against Dalton. I actually so, beat Dalton. That's what? Dalton. Black Ops 3. Yeah. Dalton I've can seen, take yeah. all You of only us beat him because win. he fucking. He had a shitty ass TV. It was his big ass TV. 
Yeah, well, dude, yeah, when you play on a bigger TV, amazing it, on small TVs. Yeah, I play amazing on small TVs. I don't know if you guys saw, but on the beta, I was doing insanely good. And when the game first came out, I was doing insanely good as well. Like, I think just playing on a smaller TV is just easier because you don't have to look for so many fucking like cues on a huge ass TV. Like, I play on my mo- uh, my computer monitor when I'm going like hardcore for Call of Duty, and it's like a 21 inch, and it's perfect for me when I'm playing Call of Duty. One but one one pl- Johnny. Yeah. <laughs> if I'm playing like Grand Theft Auto, I'd rather play on my 32 inch TV. I want to 1v1 you. <laughs> Alright, good. We could Mortal record Kombat. that. Yeah, we could record See, that. He no, always no, says no. that. <laughs> I said that's like the perfect 1v1 game. <laughs> eh. Oh, I don't smart. like fighting games. I've played Mortal Kombat with Dalton and. I bet you Psycho's hella good at Mortal Kombat. Psycho is. The only reason why you say that so you can beat me because I fucking hate Mortal Kombat. What is it? I beat Dalton the first game on our Mortal Kombat little tournament thing, and I beat him the first game. He beat me the second, and then in the middle of our tiebreaker, he had won one round, I won one round, and then when we're on the tiebreaking match, like, round, it's fucking my internet cut out, and we didn't get to finish it. No. So we have no clue if I'm I'm better than Dalton at Modern War or Mortal Kombat, or he's better Mortal than Kombat. me. We're kind of just... Even because we didn't get the tiebreaker going. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's crazy. I I really like. I think I've only won we won Dalton once, and I don't know. Like I don't even remember it, but I think I've done it before on like MW two. Me and Dalton like when we uh two v two winner and Psycho, we did so good. And it's not it well, it's because we're both good at the game, but it's because like communication. Like I highly doubt Psycho and we're like, oh, he's over here, like you know, you know, blah blah blah, like giving call outs, like really helping each other out, like me and Dalton were. So mm. I don't know. Teamwork wins games. Believe we should it or not. do we should <laughs> like a rematch on Black yeah, Ops. Yeah, definitely. Three. I'm down. I need to get my skill up though. You need to let me play some like multiplayer for an hour or two. <laughs> yeah. Because I haven't played really any. Competitive console games in a while, so. Oh my god. Right. Okay, so Dalton. Topic? Oh yeah, who wants to pick another topic? Dalton said he should be back soon. Soon? Alright. Yeah. Uh... Well, we'll pick another topic until then. We got like 30 topics. So yeah, if anything, we'll get his input about things when he comes back. How about work stories? Ooh. Work stories. Well, well he's got I think we should wait for, for Dalton. Yeah, I was going to say, Dalton's got a couple of good work stories. So. Oh my god. Hmm. Um, yeah, he just had something come up that he couldn't get his attention away from so Ooh, i saw this on mine and psychos uh what do we think about black ops 3 fallout 4 and the new updates to like grand theft auto so um, i guess we could start with black ops 3 because i know everyone in here's played that yeah black ops yeah james 3. has played it uh mm-hmm. in my opinion i thought i was gonna hate it same to be honest and same when i too. first started playing it was kind of slow and sluggish like i was i was not amped for it at all and then i started playing it a little bit more and i was kind of like you know what i'm i'm enjoying this god uh i thought i was gonna hate the fact like with all the the fucking jumping around and all that crap like it was gonna be another like advanced warfare mm-hmm. type of thing thought, Titanfall, the shit saw, all that crap when i first saw it kind of remind me of halo oh yeah no, nah, Halo. Oh my God, I hate Get Halo. Me started on Halo. I me too. fucking was raised on Halo, and I loved it. And then now they just kind of ruined it with Halo Five, in my opinion. They yeah. just all this new crap that they added. I went into a Halo Five match and I died immediately because I was so used to my old school style of playing on like Halo Three, and it was just fucking. I think Halo Three was the last best one. Halo yeah, Three was, I was gonna say, amazing I, multiplayer. I played Halo Three with uh, Psycho and Dalton. It was it was so much fun. Oh my god, it was amazing. But back to Call of Duty. Um, I originally only wanted it for zombies, and it turns out that I'm actually preferring multiplayer over zombies because I do not like the new zombies. Johnny, to be Johnny, once you get the giant, you'll love zombies again. I'm telling you. Yeah, because the giant has been my, the, my yeah, favorite map. dude. I was gonna say on like the Shadows of Evil, I think is the name of the zombies map. Yeah, the, Shadows the com- of Evil. That comes with, yeah, that comes with Black Ops. That map is just it's a cool concept and it's it's cool that it's they're right. trying to like add monsters and stuff into it, but it just feel it doesn't feel there's like just, zombies. There's yeah. too much. Like it's yeah, it's very I, complicated. Like what is it? Like I was saying and I was making a joke about it, but I was like, oh, I miss the old zombies where you kind of just run around and kill shit and have fun getting to high rounds. This one is kind of yeah. just work and a process it, it like, really is 
you got to do a ritual for everything. You got to find all these fucking pieces. Like that's okay for like Easter eggs, but like if the whole map is honestly based around finding all this shit, so you can actually do shit like the pack a punch, then it's just kind of. Irritating. I haven't even yeah I haven't even gotten past like round twenty on Shadows of Evil. I haven't even upgraded. I don't even know what it's about. I I, yeah. I don't even want. I don't upgrade, even want it. It's so much easier. Yeah. Is it okay? Yeah, well. It's... The giant, I, I guess I like it because it's that, that Call of Duty, World at War, the Zombies Reese. nostalgia. Original characters, too. Yeah, original characters. And it's just, it's so good. Like, I know the map perfectly. I know how to run trains. I know how to do Easter everything. To it. it's fucking, I haven't even done that. It's fucking Doris. Doris was one of the best, it's my favorite Zombies map mm -hmm. that they've ever made. Matt, you know Honestly, the like, it's just perfect. What's up, winner? You know the old Easter egg, the flight trap? Yeah. That's like the main Easter egg for that map now. Oh, cool. I'm back, by the way. I know how to do that one by the back of my hand. What's up, Nathan? Hello. So, um, Nathan, what do you think about Black Ops 3? I think it's great. Well, yeah, well, I've, you know. uh, I play PC personally, and oh, you guys know that. <laughs> well, it's, the yes. same, it's the same game. Right? Yeah, yeah, there's no difference. But, like, I think it's a great game. Honestly, on my speculation at first, I thought it was going to be terrible. I, I had my serious doubts yeah. for it, but once I started playing the game and I... It just had like that nostalgic feel in the multiplayer. I'm gonna be completely honest. I felt like it I was felt playing... like Black Ops Yeah, too. it felt like Black Ops 2 were like yeah. Modern Warfare 2 and the chaos of that. And you know, it's it, I like how they in included the three lane maps, what, not two lane, which was mm -hmm. so boring and very like dull and... But you mm -hmm. know, like when I played it and... Predictable. The implementation of the supply drops and how you earn the the keys through um playing the actual game and you know doing yeah you don't have to buy them yeah you can buy them but it's like you can earn them yeah yeah and like you could buy them yes but like you know it, it feels a lot more accomplished uh like more uh like you did something more if you just rewarding. got them legit yeah more rewarding, yeah, rewarding. so you know um i personally think black ops 3 is amazing now um i started off on the beta and I'm not even joking, within the first hour of playing the beta, I was like, this game is going to be great if they stick to what's on the beta. And I, it was insane. Like I, I felt like in the beta, everyone else was like a toddler in elementary school playing a football game with high schoolers. <laughs> like, I was just wrecking everybody. Like It was so outmatched. <laughs> That's how it was. I, yeah, I had so much fun. That's how I felt like first getting into Advanced Warfare. Like when it came out, like I got into Advanced oh, yeah. Warfare and it was like that. It was so fucking easy. I think my first yeah. game I went like twenty seven and three. <laughs> yeah, I mean Call of Duty. I feel like it's it's not like it got easier, but maybe I've gotten better after all these years of playing multiplayer. Uh, Honestly, yeah. I was so shit back. Like yeah, I think the last Call of Duty game I played with you guys was Ghost. Yeah, I was. Yeah. I've always been like an average player at Call of Duty, but I think. Uh, Black Ops 3, I'm definitely above average. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Same here. There, there are CODs, like, I don't think of myself as, like, a great player. I'm average around that, too, but there are, like, some CODs that I was really good at. Like, I was good at well, Modern Warfare 3, like, with my PP90 and my P99 yeah, pistol. Like, I, I had all that shit golden. I was unstoppable with that. I feel like... And then... Okay. And then, like, Black Ops 2, I started getting, like, eh, alright. Because I didn't really play, like, much... Like, I played the first Black Ops multiplayer, but not, like, a huge amount of it. So I was kind of just like, eh, I didn't really... I skipped over a COD, kind of. But I love yeah. Black Ops, the series, the whole series. Oh, yeah. They favorite. perfected it. They, they've they done... they Like, what I like about Black Ops is that they took what's good about Call of Duty, and they took the basics of it, and they took the, the complexity of advanced warfare and turn it into just something super simple and that people don't have they to like did it worry right. about. Like, yeah, they did yeah. it right. Like where, yeah, exactly. where Infinity Ward and Act not Activision and Sledgehammer yeah, did Sledgehammer. wrong is that they, they made it really complex and just Sledgehammer fucked it up. And they yeah. made they just took everything that in advance, Call of Duty in players advanced did not warfare. Like and they just yeah. put it in there. Okay, no. In Advanced Black. Warfare, being able just to even move around, you had to be, like, a really good player. Like, you had to be able to navigate the map while fucking, like, hopping off of shit, like, boosting and, like, hitting walls and shit. I feel like oh, in 
Black Ops 3, any player can pick it up and generally be, like, good at the map. Like, they can figure out where they need to go. They can get around to, like, spot to spot without having too much difficulty. Oh, yeah, totally. What, what I like better about that is that it's simpler. Like, now with, in Black Ops 3, like, it's press A to jump on walls, do that. Like, yeah. it's all the normal jump button. What I hated about Advanced Warfare is that the uncomfortableness of like having to click down the joystick oh, to do a yeah. boost forward sideways back so it, it it just didn't feel right like it just felt off to just click that all the time and i, I don't know, know about... like you, you're gonna click it for running but when you're up in the air like it just feels weird to just push all that shit yeah. i don't know about you guys but i feel like black ops 3 is the first game that they've made modern that actually felt like it was modern like futuristic and the reason i'm saying that is because like if you guys look at the the user menu and stuff like that like when you press start it's got like a whole menu of things that you can actually like change and adapt to your player like your personal settings that you couldn't do in other call of duties like i just feel like black ops 3 really hit it on the nail where like yeah. th they've set the standard of what call of duty yeah. should be uh -huh. yeah so apparently i was searching up the stats for an average cod player and it's 0 0.9 to 0 0.7 that's kind of so disgusting. that's the kd yeah uh, that's that's yeah. an average cod player that's disgusting. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's like getting what, fifty. So okay, so let's say you get fifty kills, but you die like a hundred times, one hundred twenty times. <laughs> it's not really good. Garbage. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty garbage. Pretty garbage. <laughs> like my my KD ratio right now. I know like everyone just fucking talks about KD ratios and shit, but like right now in Call of Duty Black Ops Three, it's been my, my highest, and other than like any other fucking Call of Duty I've played. Mm. Yeah, I was talking with my brother-in-law about leveling up, and uh, he was saying like, I don't know if you guys remember, but in Ghost there was a there was a uh, game mode called Squads, uh -huh. and you would create your own little squad that played like you, and you would like gear them up with certain guns, and you'd go and like play against a guy with his squad, and it was like you'd kill a bunch of bots and then a real player, and it was so easy to level up. That's how I got to. Uh, to the level where I am right now on Ghost, which I don't uh, know what it is, but Ghost, in my opinion, was disgusting. I would just, yeah, it I would just play squad. I liked. Okay, hold on. I liked it, but it wasn't like you a next gen. It, was it wasn't terrible. a next gen Call of Duty. It felt like a a newer version of MW3. Right, let's be honest here. They they <laughs> the, they had everything they, they had needed to idea. make a perfect game, but they executed True. it horribly. I don't know, if you guys look at the coloring from the 360 and the Xbox One, it's like super gray and dull and brown. It just, it's not even colorful. It looks like, I know war games are supposed to be like dirty and like they're supposed to feel like you're in a war. But like Call of Duty hasn't been a war game since like Call of Duty 3 or Call of Duty 2. Like as soon as they implemented multiplayer, it went to like a like close quarters combat game where like uh, the theme of the map doesn't matter so much. But, I don't know, if you guys have been playing, like, it, or Black Ops 3, you can tell it's, like, colorful, it's really bright, everything's futuristic. I like it. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I, I, just, I didn't like the dullness of... Uh, I, Advanced Warfare had dullness, and so did Ghost. What is it? You I think... From all these Black fucking, Ops... Like... Go ahead. Oh, well, Black Ops 1 was really dull as well, but Black Ops 2 was so colorful, and it was great. Like, Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3 are just perfect, or perfect map designs, perfect uh, graphics. I mean, I don't know. I think it was great. Yay, our lord yeah. and savior, Vondahar. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> well, you go. You know, like, like two years ago, they would have been saying he's a devil. Right? <laughs> yeah. I remember you when, from... when. Oh, my... oh, excuse me. No, go ahead, Psycho. Oh, thank you. Um. Anyways, uh, I remember when, remember in uh Black Ops Two when they nerfed the DSR <laughs> and started sending <laughs> Vondahar death threats. <laughs> <laughs> Christ. Oh my God. What? I don't know. You know I think Vondahar the thing... hates gingers. Were you quiet? <laughs> <laughs> the thing I hated most about Ghost, I think, is probably because you go from like having all these CODs that are like fast paced and in your face and you're always running around shooting things to going to a COD where the multiplayer is just long range camping, mm -hmm. all the things people hate about COD. Like you're just like, oh, camper, all this. And that's just all fucking advent or ghost multiplayer was was just people with like marksman rifles or snipers and it was barely anyone running around in the center of the map and it just pissed me off it was slow and boring and this i and then extinction i don't know what the fuck they thought 
They were yeah, I know, dude. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. The first extinction map was fun. I played that with Psycho, Winter, and Dalton. It was a boatload of fun. Like we were having like a hell of uh, like a hell of a good time, just like fighting monsters and shit. But like when the second one came out, it was like it was really bad. And I was just like, I don't feel like I want to play anymore. this anymore. Yeah, like it just got really bad. I don't know. Uh huh. Extinction was a terrible. Like it's they tried something new and it didn't work as always. Though. I would honestly say that I would get ghosts but i would rent it if they made a ghost too because the only thing i would probably be interested in is the story because honestly yeah. the story was the only thing i enjoyed about ghost yeah dude, the, the story, story was really good the story kept me interested i love the whole fucking you have all this shit where you go back and forth and you're playing as like yeah. all, all the different operatives and certain missions and you have the uh. fucking you have riley who i love yeah dude the and then dog. the ending <laughs> just fucking kept you on your toes because now you just want to know what happens mm -hmm. and that's what i loved about it because i played the story first and i expected like the thing to be good and i played through the story and i was like oh wow this is great and then i played multiplayer and i was like fuck they ruined this yeah, dude i don't know if you remember but right before ghost was about to come out they had the chance um activision said you guys can carry on zombies for this next generation console if you want they declined. They're like, no, we have our own thing. We're going to do fucking extinction. Like, oh my god. I'm kind of yeah. glad they didn't do zombies because I think they would have fucked it up. They would. Because <laughs> everyone thought they were going to do zombies because they have, yep. oh, we're releasing this new game mode. We're going to have this special game mode, like the surprise game mode. And they got yep. you so hyped up to find out what it was. And then they're like, aliens. <laughs> <laughs> aliens. <laughs> yeah. It was just so right. dumb. At first, Shit. at first the, it was actually it looks kind of cool. Like you gotta admit, like trailers and shit was like, hey, mm -hmm. it, it might got not me be so too hyped. bad. But then as soon as you, you play it, you're like, what the fuck is this? There's a game ending. There's an ending to this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was just stupid. Like you're kind of just sitting there most of the time, just shooting aliens that are trying to destroy a drill. That's basically <laughs> a lot of the game. <laughs> yeah. My favorite um, point of, like, extinction was just taking those, like, throwing knives and hitting the, like, fucking scorpion aliens with them. Yeah. And I like the teamwork. I like the teamwork because I felt like you couldn't get anything done unless you were communicating with the people that were in your game. Like, me, Winner, and Psycho, and Dalton had so much fun playing that. Like, I, that was definitely one of the best moments in Ghost. Um, yeah. Dude, but Advance War. Oh, go ahead, James. Oh, anyways, moving on to Advanced Warfare, <laughs> um, they I think they fucked up zombies too. Like they tried. They tried I just hard. I don't they yeah I don't like I don't like training a crowd of zombies. It's like yeah this is just like Call of Duty World at War, and then like one of them is like a fucking like shocker or whatever, and if you kill him, he like splatters shit all over the ground, or like zombies with exosuits can beat you down like three oh, times as fast. Advanced Warfare zombies. The Advanced yeah. Warfare zombies was just. I don't know. I didn't like you said the whole like oh exo zombies and all that crap was yeah. stupid. Upgraded but it was zombies. also the easiest zombies to get to like round twenty plus. Eh, kind of. It was easy so too. simple. The yeah, first well, time I think I played zombies? Advanced Warfare zombies like it was Dal with Dalton and it was me mm -hmm. and him and we got to I think like round thirty plus our first try and it was with these two online people and we just had to carry them the whole time. Mm. That was the same yeah. with me and Azov Taco. Yeah, I think the Advanced Warfare Zombies was just way too easy, in my opinion. I like the I did like yeah. that, that they made. I did like that um, Shane from The Walking Dead was in there. Oh, that yeah. was cool, yeah. They that had was Shane, cool. they had John Makovich. Yeah, liked. the guy from, uh, uh, it's called Red. Yeah. The movie. Yeah. And then in Black Ops 3 Zombies, I like to have Clay from fucking Sons of Anarchy. Yeah. That's fucking great. Amazing. Uh, Alright, does anyone... Oh, what were the other games? Fallout 4 and Black... <laughs> and GTA. Oh, yeah. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Black Ops 3 got like a full hour second. Fuck it. Um, uh, yeah, Fallout, uh, Fallout 4. I gotta say, in the terms of the, like, the UI menu... It looks cheesy. It looks like someone tried to do something and they and they fucked it up. They're like, fuck, we gotta release it. You know, just throw this on real quick. Like, it's... I like how you can change the color of, like, your Pip-Boy screen. But it's almost disorienting. Like, if you have it anything yeah. but green or blue, it looks bad. Like, red looks terrible. Red, uh, yellow you looks bad. you can't see what's on the Pip-Boy. 
Yeah, exactly. And then it's um, just dumb because you would think if you change like the whole HUD color to red, that it would mm-hmm. make like the enemy symbols like a different color. But no, it just nope. keeps them red, so you don't know who's a yep. good guy, who's an enemy. Yep. Um. One thing though, since uh, Johnny, I think you finished the story, and so did you, Winner. Do not spoil it, because me and Nathan I... are. Um... Honestly, did not finish the whole story. I got to oh, okay. did every the institute, and then I was oh, kind of okay. just like, all right, well, I don't know well, what to do. Yeah, me and Nathan are still playing it, so don't spoil it. Even if you think it might be a spoiler, just don't, because me and Nathan are still playing. Uh, Nathan's actively playing. I haven't been playing it as much, because I've just been more interested in other games, but yeah. I'd definitely like to finish it. With, what is it? With Fallout 4, like, I don't think I was as big into the Fallout series as, like, Dalton or Matt were in James. Yeah. <laughs> but like i had played the fallout games but like i played new vegas like a long time ago like when it was first out and i was a little kid because my sister's boyfriend had it and every time i went over he'd let me play and so when i got the new Ooh. one i was like you know what might as well everyone's gonna get fallout 4 it seems kind of interesting yeah, try and it cool. out. so i got it to try it out and i loved it like i had so much fun yeah. for the time being and then you kind of oh. What I didn't like is that you kind of hit this point when you're kind of just like, all right, now what do I do? Uh, Dude, uh, you don't even know the half of that, Johnny. You haven't even beat I, the story. Like, I don't know if I that. beat the story. I'm like at yeah, a point in the story and I still have that feeling. Like, all right. Like, I'm with Johnny on that. Like, I feel like I, the reason I stopped playing is just because I wasn't interested. And it's not because I'm not interested in the story. It's because, like, I just couldn't, like get myself to go do the next main mission i was like oh i could build my base or i can do this or this but i'm like eh, i just I don't, I don't really want to play i feel like they need to push you along more towards the story like they really need to get you more invested like, at the, the moment DLC. yeah when what? a DC, dlc comes that's oh, when yeah. i'll kind of just be like you know what all right i'll play fallout again because i yeah. have it i haven't beat the story but i'm kind of i hit a point where in the story i was kind of just like well i already kind of know everything like the story to be honest, was very easy to figure out. <laughs> yeah. It's boring. If you were going to go along like certain lines, you're basically going to know what happened. If you choose this side, then you do something to that side. If you choose this oh, side, dude. you do something to that side. You go trying to find your son, and you end up knowing what's going to happen to him. Like It's kind of just easy to put together and find out when you're going along the way. Well, but you know, Johnny, like... Predictable. What they yeah. did, and I know James knows this, and so does Winter. Anyone who's played Fallout in Vegas knows this. Right off the beginning, like as soon as you get out of Good Springs, you can go with the NCR. Um, a little bit down the story, you can go with the Legion, or you can go with Mr. House. Uh-huh. They always gave you an option, no matter what. You always had an option to go with this side or this side. I feel like in Fallout 4, they really pushed you towards the Brotherhood of Steel, and that's where I'm with the Brotherhood uh, with the Brotherhood of Steel right now. Wait. I just kind of feel like they forced you into it. They didn't give you enough choices. Don't forget... Um... In Fallout New Vegas, you get to kill the Brotherhood of Steel, like the last remaining people in there. Okay, well, when I, the Brotherhood of Steel isn't technically a, a main faction of it because they weren't at the dam fighting. Is yeah, it, the Brotherhood of Steel didn't help at the dam. Yeah, so, yeah. I, don't, I, don't I don't know. Yeah, you kind of like. We're good. No, go ahead, Winter. You were talking. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, well, oh god. If, if I can input something, um, I've been I've only spent about like four hours or so into Fallout Four, but I definitely think that so far the side quests are more interesting than the main story. <laughs> because uh, yeah, I've been oh, yeah I've been I don't know how, but I've avoided oh. every single Fallout Four um, spoiler I could, and I don't I honestly don't really know what's gonna happen. I just know few parts. It, yeah. But, um, you Dude, know, it's... Say, there's multiple endings. Like, if you pick with the Brotherhood of Steel, there's gonna be endings inside of the endings to the Brotherhood of Steel. <laughs> it's like, it's so bad. It's really confusing. Huh. Oh, one thing I have to add, though. The Minutemen. How fucking lame is that? <laughs> one guy. <laughs> one guy. You know him for, like, a day, and he's like, you're the general, ta-da! Like, it's... That was so stupid, like... There's one guy, and I know, like, the Minuteman is actually, like, a story quest that you can go and do, and there's yeah. more Minutemen, but, like, that he promotes you to general instantly is really lame. Like, oh, God. Because he's just, I, I Matt, you, like, just a dude. If you beat all the, the quests in it, there's this, it keeps mm-hmm. going. There's no ends. 
There's no end. <laughs> there is no end. Yeah. I've done so many of them, and it's just no. Go because... capture that settlement. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, if the that's all the minigames really are. Ah, ah. like, oh, go do this for that settlement. Oh, it's like every so dark run downtime, something happens. Like just something oh, God, falls and like breaks or like drops something place. spells. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, I gotta clean this. <laughs> There's soda in my goddamn keyboard right now. You can just hear Holy him say, shit. you can just hear the oh doubt god, in his voice like, oh my god, I gotta clean this. <laughs> my god. Oh, how's, how's, um, how's, um, how's your new house? How's my new Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's great. Um, you know, I, I told you guys everything about, like, what had happened, right? Mm, no. I don't think so. Oh uh, no, no. Well, I'll share it because fuck it. I mean, I don't really mind everyone else all knowing, but um, it's kind of like busy right now. So, so <laughs> basically, um, I went to grab my mod, and it was right next to my soda, and it spilled the soda all over my keyboard at the back end of it. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I'm gonna be cleaning this up while you guys talk. Okay. But um, uh, as you guys know, I was living with my mom when I first started talking to you guys, right? You you, you all know that, right? Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, um, a bunch of shit happened there. She could no longer take care of us, so I had to move in with my dad. Well, my dad, he wasn't exactly in the right, correct, like, good position, and he was living. He couldn't take care of three kids. Yeah, he took. He couldn't really take care of us three, and we were living at my mom's house or at his mom's house. And basically, my sister was sleeping in the same room as him, and me and my brother were living sleeping in the living room on the floor. So. You know, it was really rough, and then we finally moved out of the, my grandma, my grandma's house into a different house. But it's something called um, oh geez, Pathways of Hope. Yeah, P O H. And um, basically, what it is is they uh, they uh, they provide you a home until you find a job. And this bas this is basically for people who have um, who have difficulties on finding a job and like who are basically homeless. And you know, but they have kids and they need somewhere. Yeah, they need somewhere to be because they have the kids, and we were lucky enough to get in there. But the thing is about that place, it only ha it was a single room. It was rectangular, and it was a lot smaller than my room right now. So yeah. think about four people: my dad, which who was like fifty something, my brother who was currently seventeen, uh, a a fifteen year old, and a or ten year old, all in a <laughs> single compact um room. Too much. It was a lot, and so as you guys know, I was. I can't remember. I think only Matt knows, but I was going to a fucking cafe after school every day because we had no like Wi-Fi or anything, and I had Wi-Fi homework. I had to use Wi-Fi for homework, and I was always at the this cafe doing my homework there, and it was yeah. just it, Nathan. Yeah, Nathan. The first time he played H one Z one with with me was in a cafe, <laughs> and it's a twenty it's oh a twenty God. gigabyte download, and. It took him like two hours to download twenty gigabytes, even to play the game. It was going at one point four megabytes yeah. per second, and I was just it was dying, and it was terrible. And <laughs> we were on Skype, and Nathan's webcam is just him, and there's like all these people walking behind him, he's just playing <laughs> the cafe. You know, they were really nice. You know, I got they gave me free coffee yeah. and stuff, and they would let me stay later than you than most people. And you know, that's good. What, what, what was good oh, is wait, that we, wait a minute. What. I remember that because I remember there was the one time we were talking and some lady came up and offered you a sandwich. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was the, uh, that's Donna. She's, uh, she's the owner of the place. She's really cool. I love her to death. That was funny. And, uh, you know, it's, they're, they're really close friends of ours and they've helped us through a lot and, like, I basically owe them a lot because, you know, I was in there before closing hours and they basically offered me a job but I turned them down because of school and everything. And at the yeah. time, I was going to uh, a really, like, fucking hard-ass school called, uh, if, uh, probably no one knows about it, but it's called Troy. And it was a really hard-ass school, and, like, it was, like, number one in the county, and it was fucking insane. Wait, you what? live near, you live in Riverside or Orange County? I live in Orange County, uh, your Belinda, I'm, currently. I'm pretty sure I've heard that name somewhere. It's in Anaheim. Which is close to Yorba Linda, which I moved to Yorba Linda, and now I'm going to another school, which I'm not going to say the name of, because I don't want to die. Psycho, Psycho, don't you live in L.A.? Um, I live in L.A. County, and I live in a small um, <clears throat> city, 
It's called Paramount. Oh, cool. oh, I've been there. Yeah, my friend Joey lives there. Joey? Whoa, bro. Yeah. Isn't your brother I was gonna say, Psycho, Joe? don't you have like three sisters and like two brothers? I have two sisters and one brother. Um, yeah. And they are annoying. Yeah, see, Psycho, Nathan can relate to you like hardcore. <laughs> Dude, it fucking sucks. I have a brother it who's does. 18. He's a lazy like, I... piece of shit and is so fucking. Yeah. I had to share a room with him, and my room was always fucking messy. And my... it was like a split fucking line down the room. My side was clean. <laughs> line. I'm not even kidding. It pissed me off so much because I was always trying to focus on doing homework and shit, and like just the mess around me was pissing me off. And like there was a split fucking line down the room of his dirty ass fucking mess on the side with all these pu fucking popcorn bags. And it smelled like fucking popcorn in my room all the damn time because he never stopped eating the fucking popcorn. And just oh my he God. pisses me off so fucking much, oh, and like shit. I smelled like popcorn when I went to school. And I'm like, oh, why do you smell like popcorn? I'm like, because my fucking brother doesn't have a popcorn addiction. It's like, shit, man. Jesus. Do you work at the movie theater? Or do you move? Or do you work at the movie theater? Like you smell like popcorn all the time. Oh God. <laughs> Yeah, um, I, don't, I can't relate to any of you guys because my sister is older than me. She's 18, and she's already out of the house. Like, she moved the fuck out as soon as she got eight, or she turned 18. Dude, my brother so, got fucking kicked out. Yeah, Whoa. my sister. Time I had a brother before he got kicked out. Go ahead, James. No, that wasn't James. That was Johnny. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, well, anyways. I had uh, when I first moved out to Ohio, fucking, I had my little brother. My stepbrother, my stepsister, and my sister all wow. living with us, including me, and then my two parents, all living in a two-bedroom house. <laughs> and we first had a two-bedroom apartment, and then that was just fucking shit. And then, so we got in a house, like a duplex, and so we had to split the basement into sections for my sister, <laughs> my stepsister, and then the boys shared a room upstairs. And it was just, it was awful. <clears throat> just all like three people cramped into one small room it was just ridiculous uh, uh, see like I said I can't relate because uh, I don't know but I bet uh, Nathan obviously you fight with your brother I bet you you fight with your sister Psycho oh, yeah. I bet you fight with your siblings Especially Johnny I know you probably fought with yours Absolutely. my uh, sister he probably threatened my to sister. kick his brother's ass <laughs> no like my sister and um my stepsister, I get along with amazingly, and my oldest brother, who is like thirty something, who lives out in Florida. Well, and wait, what? I get along Your brother's with him. thirty. Yeah. I mean, my it's dad kind of is sixty. He's old enough to be your dad. 50. It's, it's sad like because my brother's thirty. Yeah. Yeah, my dad's <laughs> old. My dad's sixty something. My mom's fifty. So. Yeah, my dad's like old parents. sixty fucking eight. Yeah, you guys have really old parents. Like, I think I'm the only one here besides Dalton and Psycho who have young parents. How old are your parents? Your mom. My my my, or my dad's like 45, and my mom's like 42. Like, I Dude, I guess that's pretty awesome. young. My mom's about the same age. She's really nice. My my mom? Yeah. Mama Dark Rain. Yeah, I guess she's nice. Yeah, and Mama Dark Rain. <laughs> Mama well, Dark Rain. If, if, if you knew how she treated me, you guys. No. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my beats god. him on the daily. <laughs> yeah. No. The um, story and, yesterday. Yeah. Me and my sister have always gotten along. I love my sister to death. And I, I'm i sure whoever has been playing video games with me, you know that I just, like, if my when my sister lived with me, I'd be like, I want fucking baby burritos. Five minutes later, baby Shoot burritos come in the room. <laughs> yeah. Like, my sister was like, uh, she always took care of me. She always did anything and everything I asked. So I love my sister to death. And we never really fought, like, honestly. And if we did, it'd be over, like, something stupid. And then we wouldn't care about it in an hour, so. Oh, dude, yeah. you're lucky. <laughs> well, that's how me and my older sister are. Like, my actual older sister. We get along so, like, amazingly. Like, she wants to actually like, move in together with when I move out. And, but I plan on getting, because I already found, like, a three-bedroom <clears throat> apartment. Which is she the amazing. one that got like the nigger to steal all your shit? <laughs> oh, shit. We're recording! Shit. We're recording! Are you serious? Oh my god. <laughs> Are you serious? She didn't get anyone to steal anything. It was. <laughs> her house got broken into. And yeah, but. My, my <laughs> knife collection got taken. Sad that face. Sucks, bro. Mm -hmm. Let's right. get that part out.
What's his face? <laughs> um, Jesus Christ. Dalton, what were we talking? ETA. I don't even fucking know. Oh, uh, we were talking about. Um. <laughs> uh, um. <laughs> oh no. Okay, we're so we're talking about Fallout Four. <laughs> Yeah, back. we started with Black Ops 3, and then Fallout 4, and then Family Issues, and now we're oh back to God. GTA 5. GTA 5, <laughs> which, by the way, me and Matt played today, and oh, honestly, yeah. the fucking yacht is amazing. Dude, it's so cool. Like, it's awesome. There's like three bedrooms in it, and you can use all the bedrooms. There's like detailed bathrooms. Yeah, you can have people uh, live a, with you. <laughs> yeah, you can have people live with you, and there's like a bartender, like an actual bartender. Yeah. And um, like every chair in there, you can sit on. And I know that sounds lame, but it's really cool to me. And then, and, like, uh, down then it like and it drops weapons and everything. And then you fucking and then yeah. there's a hot tub on the deck, and then you can just fucking go into it. As soon as you walk into the hot tub, like swimming trunks immediately appear yeah. on you. <laughs> yeah, and dude, there's a you can have a heli or a private helicopter, a private boat, a private jet skis, Wait, and what? um, yeah, when are like two private boats, two private jet skis, a private helicopter, and what are you it's about? it's amazing. We're talking GTA about the, yacht. the oh, new GTA update. 5. Yeah, it, it's a, it's so cool. And Johnny's right, like weapons just spawn in all the rooms, yeah, like just weird. random weapons, like ammo. Yeah, like I got into really bed, cool. like in uh, when I uh, saw the yacht, I got into bed and I randomly got fourteen dollars just picked up on the ground. Yeah. Like I was like, oh, I guess money and weapons are everywhere. Yeah, and fucking, it was really cool. Yeah, each oh. room has like a bed you could lay on. It's got a bathroom oh, for everyone. It's um, fucking awesome. I'm gonna buy an Xbox One, a new one, since mine is broken. And no, when are just don't you have a warranty? What? Don't you have a warranty? What do you mean? A warranty, like a warranty to don't fucking you have get a, a new one. On your Xbox? Yeah. I don't think so. Uh, who is that? That's <laughs> James. James, how do you start this with like a good sounding connection to? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, it's when he it's when he's on kick and not on Skype. It goes down a little bit. But know. yeah, dude, the new update's insane. Like the lowrider update. Like I think did they add lowrider part yeah, two? Um, okay, so the no, lowrider updates. Part two. Okay, well, the Lowrider update and plus whatever update they just added is super cool. Like, there's a machete, a uh, switchblade, which is really cool. Like, when you pull oh, yeah. it out, it, like, flips out. And then, like, when you put it back in your inventory, it flips back in. Um, there's a flashlight that you can actually, like, use and point at shit. The brass knuckles. Um, brass knuckles. That, one, that one's actually kind of old. But um, they also added, like, a machine gun pistol. And it's, I don't know. I think they're doing good things with GTA. Like, if you yeah, just stop playing GTA for, like, I don't know, four months, good shit happens. Like, for real. <laughs> like, okay. just a bunch of new stuff. What I like about this time around with GTA is that when I had it on the 360, or GTA 5, and then, like, they're doing more with the holiday stuff, and it's fucking oh, yeah. awesome. Like, they're adding cool things with the holiday. And this time, for Halloween, they actually added costumes and masks and yep. all that shit. It, it was, was cool. awesome. Like, on the 360, they added that random shit for, like, Valentine's Day and, then like, uh, yep. Christmas. And I was like, why the fuck didn't they take advantage of the whole mask system and yeah. all that crap for halloween and then even in this one they added those cool like halloween cars and all that crap but i never got to buy one because i wanted the i didn't get one, one either but um yeah. what is it and then the whole like vip like bodyguard thing i don't oh, know what yeah. that is that's but i cool. heard like if you're a bodyguard you get five thousand mm -hmm. dollars like an hour yeah so apparently you can like you can be a VIP, which is someone who's over or who has over a million dollars, and you just walk around and you have like three guys that pr just protect you all the time, and they get paid like five grand every like fifteen minutes. Yeah, that's just so cool. And you get like all these badass looking like camos yeah. and the guns and the, yeah on the revolver oh. and the switchblade. Oh yeah, dude. But um, you can like so if you're a VIP. Then um, people who don't want a VIP, like they want to be a bodyguard, they can put in like looking for uh, work or something like that, and you'll just get like three guys that are assigned to you, and they're supposed to like stay with you and, and protect you. I think that's really cool. Yeah, it's a cool concept. I we're trying to figure out how to do that. <laughs> oh, I, I, uh, Jacob, the guy who was in the game with us, he told me how to do it. You just like uh, hit the back or like select menu or whatever, uh -huh. and it'll say like look for a job or something like that. Are like uh -huh. looking for hire or want to be our register for VIP. Really cool. <coughs> oh, cool. Then you, then you yeah. gotta do that. Oh, uh, the only problem I've ran into is getting money. Unless you have a hacker friend, it's gonna take you or modded way lobbies. too long. Yeah, or a modded lobby. It's gonna take you hours and hours and hours to get money. 
Uh, so uh. I I miss the days when I had like three billion plus and I was able yeah, to spend no. money like it was nothing. Oh, like a yacht? I'll buy four of them. Like, I, <laughs> like oh my yeah. god. And now they have you can have like five properties now at a time. So I want the mansions that they have too now. Like, well, they're not like exactly mansions, but they're like bigger fucking homes. Like, they're in the vine woods. Like they're in the good like house area. Yeah, me and Dalton, like we had um, one of the fans. Uh, no, it wasn't even a fan. We were in a random lobby, and the guy was like, "Oh, you guys could come into my house," and we went in, and it was fucking awesome. It was like three stories, and it was fucking. Great. Oh wow. <sighs> Anyone else have input? Well, that's it. Um, yeah. Thanks, bro. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'll just, I'll just stick <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. All right. Just... Uh, <laughs> Nathan. Probably take a break. All right, we're back. All right, guys. Uh, so oh, as we talked about, we talked about um, vapes, the games. which I don't, I don't think Dalton has that much input about vapes, uh, nah. because Dalton is back. So I'm back. Yeah. Oh. Um, Let's How see. was the other side? <clears throat> it was dark and scary and cold. Oh. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, we asked our opinions about how our 2016 is going. Dalton. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> let's see. What's today? The 19th? It feels like I'm 19 yeah. days into the new year. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um... Things that are new that we've been up to. I know Dalton has like a job now and all that shit. That is bro, wow. yeah, he's, he's got a job. He's going to college. All the good stuff. Um, Starbucks. One one new thing about Dalton is his fucking YouTube channel. You know. <laughs> Dude, man, yeah. I've already subscribed to my nigga. Ridiculous yeah. subscribers. I, don't, I haven't even done anything. Yeah. So bad. I, oh my god, I love my fans <laughs> on YouTube. I was look, like, just like a five second shout out for Dalton got him like 50 subscribers in the first like. Oh yeah, they, he, he shut up into fucking 50 subscribers, dude. Wait, do I have yeah. you on my uh, suggestions list? I do. I do. I think so. Yeah, I do. Yeah, it's right there. Yeah. And then, uh, right there. What else? Um, Dalton, your opinions on the newer games like fucking black ops 3 fallout 4 gta 5 the update that they just came out with <laughs> well no well, like the, the newer no, the updates new update. like the yachts and all that crap i'm salty Can't oh me and matt got to see a yacht getting today. moist we got to see a yacht yeah we got to mm -hmm. go on a yacht we experienced it, yeah. it was amazing. a fanboy <laughs> took us up on his yacht it was really cool Ugh. Oh, we me and you got to see a mansion together, and I got to see a yacht. Oh, bad. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> the fuck? The fuck uh, was that? Was watching porn. Um, Dalton, your input on Black Ops Three? <laughs> it's legit. I like it. Who's stuff in their face? Yeah, I, mean, I know. It is so hey. loud. Psycho. <laughs> and then no one else. We talked about Fallout 4, what you thought of it. I was too short. I found yeah. more from Fallout New Vegas, honestly. Because I beat really? Fallout within like a week. I 100%ed it. Are you serious, Tom? I already 100%ed yeah. the game, Matt. Wow. <laughs> I, I mean, I could have too, but I just I got more interested in other games, honestly. That, that might be because Fallout 4 wasn't everything I hyped it up to be, I guess. <laughs> all right. I think and everyone I did think, that. Yeah. I think... We're all caught up with Dalton right now, so... <laughs> what is it? Psycho, you wanted to bring up the next topic? Yep. Um, so, um, for the past three years, and two for, you know, Nathan and Johnny, um, I like to talk about our best and our worst moments, slash, you know, like... Every day uh, with drama. you guys is my worst moment. <laughs> wow, you're a Aww. fucking dick. We you love know you what? Too. Fuck you, Winter. Hey, hey, Shut now. the fuck up, Nathan. Suck a dick. Yeah. Hey, let's psycho. Let psycho talk. Oh, anyways, um, I like to say that uh, my favorite moments were uh, when we were in Search and Destroy and uh, Black Ops Two. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh. Zombies. When we did the Easter eggs, all the the bullshit we dealt with. Okay. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> everyone just sighs a little bit, like yeah. <laughs> I drop, I drop a bomb on everyone about Leonard here in about three seconds. Um, since he said he hates us all. Elmo Pedo. Don't forget about Elmo Pedo. <laughs> that moped. 
Uh, so for people who don't know the story, um, I was 11 years old playing um, Red Theft Auto 4 with Dalton and James. And um, me and James were driving around this uh, moped, and we called it El Mopedo, and it was like our pet. It was like a pet rock, basically. And we were driving around near like this, uh, the end of this river, and Dalton just came out of nowhere, like 100 miles an hour, and threw it into the river, and we got all pissed off at him and didn't talk to him for like a week. <laughs> <laughs> in the ocean, yeah, so or in the ocean, or was it a river? I can't remember. It was like an ocean, but we did some like stupid childish shit. You stopped talking to me for like a week because I did it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you guys remember the GTA 4 Bible that we had written. Oh, yeah, <laughs> it's made a GTA 4 Bible. Yeah. No. <laughs> oh, wait, I never got to finish my um. Oh, Matt, the worst moment. The, server, the Minecraft server. What's your worst moment? Remember that book I wrote? <laughs> oh yeah, dude, I still have it. I still have it. <laughs> yeah, it's like a trying to talk. <laughs> nah, I just let everybody else talk, but um. Let the man speak. Anyways, the worst moment I think was uh when we were doing the origins Easter egg, and like once we finished and we were all like relieved, fucking uh, Don was like, uh, we never would have finished this if it weren't for me. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> oh. That when Dalton said bullshit. that, yeah. So know. basically, um, it was me, Dalton, Winner, and Psycho, no and games. we had did it for like the second time. No, we did it. That, uh, that was the second time we did it. First time we did it oh. was with me. Okay. We didn't do well, it anyways. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, whoever uh, it was with we James, did, we did the, We always did the trades with it was you, me, Psycho, and James because like that okay. was like the OG zombie. Well, all, yeah, all four of us were doing the Origins Easter egg, and basically, I if I remember correctly, right after the match, it was like everyone's pissed off at each other, and we were just we did we were Dude, so we happy that we got like it done. Hours. Yeah, we're so happy that we finally got it done, <laughs> and Dalton made the comment that we would have never got it done if it wasn't for him, and me. <laughs> Uh, yeah, me and Dalton always like to butt heads like way back then. Like I used to just always fight with Dalton. So yeah, that like split our group into like threes. So James went with Dalton and I went with Psycho and Winter. And we didn't talk to each other for legit a year, like an actual year. <laughs> we didn't talk to each other. <laughs> I remember because me and James, we got Grand Theft Auto because we were still talking to you when Grand Theft Auto finally came out either. No, you started talking to me after yeah, um after Grand Theft Auto. Came well, actually, no. You know what got us talking in, uh, again? I was riding my or driving my doom buggy out behind your house oh, yeah. and it just like died out of nowhere and i was like shit who do i know who's home right now well not my parents i was like hmm, don might be home so i called you and you came and like towed me out of this like shit mess <laughs> but yeah um what was i gonna say go like when when you um stopped talking to us like it was just me and james like you went off and played like gta with winner and uh Psycho. Psycho. I remember when James came in after you guys talked to us. We we're like level 60s because me and him were grinding out races for like the first week it came out. And yeah. You guys are like level 10. You're like, how are you guys level 60 already? Yeah. <laughs> I remember that. So hard. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. I think after that, James, because James didn't want to talk to us, and it was just it was just gonna be like you reuniting with us because if I if I remember correctly. For some reason, James just didn't want to talk to us again. I guess there was like some bad blood or something. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> um, we've had so many fights. Yeah. Oh think... shit. One of the the funner times I think I've had with you guys is that you remember when we first like started filming and we tried to do that like stupid funny moments thing where we ran around in like oh, underwear and like cowboy God. hats. <laughs> we kept, kept do you remember the car wash? <laughs> Yeah, do you remember the car wash musical? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my shit. That's the stupidest shit ever. Or like, oh what is it? God. When fucking... Uh, fuck. Cop car. Which cop car number was it, though? Oh, Officer, Officer 69. 69. Yeah, <laughs> Officer 69. <laughs> what was the one where it was like, uh, fucking Officer 27 or some shit, Matt? I mean, you kept no. going out to a field I think and, like, it... stabbing each other to death. Yeah, I think it was Officer 29 or something like that. Officer 29. Yeah. <laughs> I like I was, it was... You guys, like, came out of my car and beat me to death because you guys kept saying that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and fucking, um, or when we had Dying Light. When we had Dying Light, that shit was uh, so much oh, yeah. fun. <laughs> I had so much fun with Dying Light, especially yeah. that one really racist game <laughs> when me, Matt and Dalton played. Oh my god, that <laughs> comment you made literally made me cry. We can't. I don't think. I don't think we can say it. 
<laughs> yeah, I don't think we can say it in the show because it's, no, it's so bad offensive. that we might. Yeah, we'll we'll catch so much hate for it. <laughs> but yeah, let's just say we were doing we were making fun of a certain situation that was going on around the time. I already said nigger, so you might as well just say it. <laughs> and he just said it again. Yeah. What I think. Yeah. Oh my god. And fucking. When it got his hip. Pitch. Okay, I think one of the worst <laughs> moments I think I've had with you guys is. That whole, like, bullshit we went through when we kept kicking Winter out of, like, the clan and all that crap. But it was, like, oh, we suspended yeah. him for oh. two months. Basically, yeah, basically Winter kept being, like, a dick to us. And since me and Dalton were the clan leaders, we're like, mm, you want to talk some more shit? Suspended for a month. And then Winter's like, bitch, I can take a month or, like, two months. And, like, he just <laughs> We kept suspending him. And then it was that. And then it was, like, after that when Matt started playing Winter on, like, PC. And you didn't talk yeah. to us for, like, a good month because you said you had replacements for us now. No, yeah, I didn't say I had... dick thing to Hold say. On. That was, that was I didn't bad. say... <laughs> I did not say I had replacements. I just said I found PC gamers that were like duplicates of you. <laughs> I was basically like saying you replaced yeah. us. Yeah, but I mean, Dalton, I gotta say, Dalton and John, you guys took it more of like a man. Like, yeah, he's just playing a different. <laughs> you yeah. guys are like, oh, he's just playing to get a different game. It's not like he replaced us. He's just playing a different game, right? Winner, you just took it so personal. You acted like I dropped you in the middle of like a fucking swamp. I'm like, go fuck we yourself. All I got acted new like friends. That, you dipshit. The fuck? No. <laughs> Dalton and Johnny did for a little bit, but after a while, they're just like, whatever. <laughs> Winner, you definitely took it way too hard. No, I, I think Winner is kind of just like a dog that is, just, just like, like so the much. main attention of the family and gets all this attention. And then you just go and you get a cat. <laughs> and then you're kind of just like, well, I got a cat now, so the dog's kind of just on its yeah. own. <laughs> and then... Winter, I think it's because Winter loves me so much that he was so broken down about it. That's probably Gee? what Because <laughs> at that point, it was kind of like we were always talking and always like playing, and then out of nowhere, you just left to start playing PC games. Well, it wasn't like out of nowhere. It was just like, Johnny, I don't know how to explain this because you haven't gone through it. It's like... It's like, oh, it's Destiny. It's Destiny. That's exactly what oh, it is. Yeah. When you guys started playing Destiny, you, okay, so the way you guys felt is exactly how I felt. Like, as soon as you guys started playing Destiny, I wanted, like, nothing to do with it. I was like, I don't want to play that game. I don't want to talk to you guys when you're playing that game. Because we all love Destiny, much. and we tried to get yeah. you into it, too, and you just weren't I tried. having it. No, Johnny, you gotta admit, I gave it a good try. I bought the fucking $60 game. I played for, like, a couple played. hours. <laughs> When I, like, brought you on, like, a month ago, me and you played, and we went, and we did Crucible, and you honestly, like, yeah. played with me for a good, like, two hours. Yeah. It was good because I was just raping people. Like, I don't know why, but everyone on Crucible just seemed really bad at the time I was playing. Crucible's pretty easy. <laughs> yeah. And, but, I don't know. I don't know. I, I guess my best moments um, with, like, Dalton, James, and, like, Psycho and Winter would definitely, like black ops 2 that was like the golden age of gaming for myself like it was we spent like every day 12, 12 hours yeah. in, like more than 12 hours 12 yeah. hours <clears throat> excuse me yeah dude that was just like every single every single day of playing black ops 3 or black ops 2 with you guys was just like it was an event it was just always fun no matter what um james i know what you're talking about so for those of you who don't know um james and dalton lived out like in this little community where i live basically and uh dalton would come over to my house and sometimes james and all three of us would have like three xboxes in one room like probably like taking out most of the power of the house and we'd all be playing call of duty and we start out like from like nine o'clock and just like all night and we just straight up play call of duty forever in one day without them. yeah in one day yeah <laughs> Yeah, me and Don um, did a lot of all-nighters when we were playing, like, World at War. We would play zombies oh for so God. long that we, literally when I, when I went to sleep after playing zombies for, like, 20 hours, I could just hear the roaring and, the, like, Rawr! like all that shit in my sleep. <laughs> See, like, with shit like that, like, honestly, one of the good moments I think we all used to have were our fucking, like, Dark Rain movie nights. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you guys remember when we watched the interview? Yeah. <laughs> that was yeah. great. But, like, the for those of you who don't know, like, we've, since we've known each other for a while, we've had those nights where instead of playing video games, we kind of just go on Netflix or some shit and just pick a random yeah. movie and we all just start at zero and Matt does his fucking famous little countdown. Three, and two, then, one. <laughs> and then we Three, just start watching. Two, 
And then he just one. stopped saying. He, no, he wouldn't even go to one. He just. Uh, no, say I, three, I say two. I, I say one, but it's quieter. Yeah. Quiet. <laughs> and I remember what is it? We watched the VHS. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. That was so, a good movie. I like. No, um, <laughs> John, you didn't watch us. Johnny, you didn't watch it the first time, but no, me, Dalton, no, Winter, and Psycho watched, watched it together. One. Yeah, me, Dalton, Psycho, and Winter watched it together, and I think Dalton and Winter dropped out, and it was just me and Psycho watching this fucked up movie of uh, like yeah, a bitch ripping one. some guy's dick off yeah. and eating it. Yeah. Yeah, but then nasty. you guys and, went back and you watched the first one with me. I yeah, think and then the we watched one the second movie one. That was so fuck. That was just fucking awful and it was ridiculous and just. Was ABC's a death when we all watched that? Oh, shit? that was so bad. That was just that was. That's one of the worst movies I've ever seen. It had think... no plot, no context. It made zero sense. And it crossed so many lines. <laughs> yeah, it really did. Like the pedophile. Like, there was part. a point. Yeah. Oh my god, we... the fucking the one where that guy had a jerk off to that little boy. Yeah, that like jerk off man. fucking game, yeah. and then yeah. that's where I shut it off because we all hit a point where we were like, no, we're done with this movie. Let's watch something else. Psycho. And I was just like. You know what, guys? No, let's keep going a little bit more. And it got to that point where there's this part of the movie funny. where it's a bunch of <laughs> fucked up scenarios ranging from A through Z. And it shows like a little skit of each the clown letter. One was and then lame. this one, I forget what fucking letter it was, but it was a thing where it was like a bunch of Japanese people. And they had two guys strapped into a chair and they had to vigorously masturbate. Oh, the yeah. First one was a Japanese. One, and they killed the dude who did it. Yeah. And then, so first, it hit a point. The first one to come. Where they had um, the guy, yeah, the guy who was winning throughout the whole thing, they hit a point where he's there right now, and then they have this old, like, skinny dude next to him, this creepy, fugly-looking guy, and then they bring out a child and lay the child on a bed, and then they bring out, like, a fat sumo guy, and I was like, nope, done, that's just <laughs> fucked up, I'm not watching the rest of this. Psycho remembers this because... I watched the whole, yeah, I watched the whole thing, too. Because we stopped watching it for like an hour, and then we were back, and we're like, we gotta fucking finish it. Yeah. Um, Psycho and Dalton, and I think Winter was there. I know you guys remember it was VHS two, the one where like there's all these Asian people in like a camp. Oh yeah. It's like oh an insane god. asylum. Oh my god. And the god. demon, yeah, the demon is like in there like killing people, and they I all commit the suicide at the same time. Oh, that was great. I like oh, I love that movie. Except for the dog that fell. Yeah. Yeah, where they dropped the dog. The dog. Yeah, that was sad. <laughs> like, I'm all for, like, pedophiles and, like, people jerking off in, like, a race, but when you kill a dog, I'm done. Like, no. <laughs> it's always sad when you kill a dog. Like, the saddest part in Eye of Legend was when he had to kill his dog. Oh, dude, have you seen the alternate ending? Yeah. Which one? Yeah, dude, the alternate ending was... It looks kind of cheesy and lame, but, I don't know, the grenade thing was epic. <laughs> what, when he, like, pulled the pin on the grenade and went charging at them yeah. when he broke through the glass? Yeah. No, the alternate ending is basically, like, he has one of the captured, like, ghoul things, and they all of them break in there, and, like, uh, the other ghoul, like, the leader or whatever, is, like, instructing him to, like, fix the one that's, like, dying on his table, and, like, eventually, like, he fixes her up, and then they leave, and there's, like, a mutual respect thing, and then they all take off towards, like, this town and, like, start a new thing or whatever. But yeah, so that that was better rather than the normal ending they had, where he just charged yeah. them with a grenade. The alternate ending so, was where he lived instead of getting blown up by an explosion. Yeah. I yeah. prefer where he lives. That was a great movie. Yeah, everyone, it was such that. a great movie. He had his no, he had no friend left. I would have killed myself too. Yeah, dude, I love how he's just like in the like CD store, like "What's up, Michelle? How you doing? I oh, got a new haircut." He's like picking out he was CDs trying to, to hit on a, to. a fucking mannequin. Yeah. <laughs> He freaked out when that, that one mannequin was out in the street and wasn't in the store. Fuck you, Fred. It's like, are you real? <laughs> Tell me if you're real. <laughs> <laughs> <Fred>. <laughs> oh my god. That's great. One of my uh, favorite moments, though, like if when we were watching TV or like watching movies together, we were watching the interview, and that movie was just funny. Like we had a good time watching hilarious. it. But um, towards the beginning of it, I was messaging a woman, and we were doing, you know. Fucking oh sexting my God. Is or whatever. This where I kept giving you yeah. lines to say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I remember that. <laughs> yeah, that was great. I was basically like sexting this girl, and Johnny and Winter and everybody was just giving me advice to like send messages to her, and like hers would be like a five, like I don't even know, like a five sentence thing, and mine's like twelve paragraphs of like dirty ass shit. <laughs> and they work though. <laughs> oh, totally. <laughs> and fucking oh that was my God. hilarious. That was hilarious. And we all fell in love with that song that was like at the end where they get on the boat oh, and yeah. drive away. Yeah. 
Oh, I forgot Bald the name spent, of like, it. Twenty Wasn't minutes it trying like, to track Scorpion it down. Or something? <laughs> yes, it's by Scorpion. In this like. Damn it! I gotta play it. <laughs> <laughs> and fucking. Oh, that movie was hilarious. Yeah, that was a good time. <laughs> and, I don't know, Matt. What was your worst points? Like besides like um, the whole fighting with Dalton. <laughs> well, that's that's honestly like my worst points. I mean, yeah, that's like the only worst. Or <clears throat> besides the H one Z one thing. Um, me and Dalton used to have a lot of fights, and they would get like bad, like really bad. Um, I remember one time, I was me and Winter had a fight. Too. Yeah, one time me and Winter had a fight, and he said some like horrendous shit oh, about my mom. God. Oh my god. Yeah, and I I forgive <laughs> I Winter that, for. And I was, that was I'm like, sorry. <laughs> I forgive Winter for it, and everyone. It's not like one of those fights where like everyone divides into sections. Like everyone's like Winter, that was fucked up. Like you shouldn't have said that. But, um, yeah, <laughs> after, like, a week or something, Winter said he was sorry and, like, you know, owned up to what he said, but... <laughs> like, can someone please text me what he said? Mm, mm, I think Dal- if Dalton... Do you want me to? Uh-huh. Yeah, you can. Dalton, you can. Go and text me. I-, I just didn't want to say it during the show. Yeah, it's that's private. why I said just text me. <laughs> like, privately. Like I will yeah. react to it on my... <laughs> But yeah, and that was like one of the only times I think everyone was on my side during a fight with Winner. <laughs> um, is it Winner? You never gave your cool. opinion on good or bad moments. Yeah. Who? Um, we have a lot of the same ones. Are every time I'm with Dalton and he makes fun of me. <laughs> bad moments <laughs> when I'm with Matt and he makes fun of me. <laughs> when I'm with Johnny and he makes fun of me. So basically, every day I'm with you guys. <laughs> Oh my god. Wow. That you make it sound edgy. like we're good moments. Yeah. Um You make I'd it sound say... like we're like just like handlers and you're like our pet clown that we make but, fun like, of all the time. When, are, when we fucking <laughs> mess with you, it's like a good five minutes of us messing with you and then we just start getting along, like immediately right after. Yeah. Either way, it's all the same bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> so depressing. Um <laughs> good moments. Um only played Black Ops too. Definitely, definitely. Another good moment. That's all I got. <laughs> oh, when you came back from DOS, that was a good moment. Oh, yeah. Oh, when I went, oh, oh that's yeah, the funnest dude. moment I've had was when I went to go see Matthew and Dalton. Yeah. And then we went bowling. Dude, and it was I cool. I almost killed Matt. Oh, it was yeah. so fun. So, I'll, I can't I'll believe tell this. I almost killed my old best friend. In I'll a tell you the accident. story. <laughs> Oh, that's sweet. Anyways, I'll tell the story. So, um, Winter was coming down for, like, the summer, like, 2014, and, uh, he's coming down from, like, um, I'll say a place, you know, like, a, a, a place over here and a place over here, okay? So, anyways, uh, Winter came down to, like, visit me and Dalton and James, because we all live in, like, the same area, and we went bowling, um, at this one place, and that was really fun, and then, uh, like, I think a couple, we went out, like, twice in my, uh, little doom buggy, right? And the second time... Um, I was like, hey, Winter, do you want to drive? And we were on this curvy-ass road. Yeah, we were on this curvy-ass road that even I was having difficult driving in. Well, actually, I, was like, hey, Winter. I did pretty good, except for oh, yeah. when that I hit right. the fucking curb. <laughs> yeah, so I was like, hey, Winter, do you want to drive? So Winter starts driving, right? And we're doing good for a little while. Like, we, we were fucking with cows and a machete. Like, there was wild cow. cows, and Winter, yeah, Winter was driving up next to him. I was trying to hit him with a machete. Wait, what? <laughs> Yeah, what was, was that with? Oh, that machete. was Dalton. <laughs> with my yeah. yeah, yeah, your machete. Yeah, okay. I fucking I took your machete and I started grinding it on the ground when Matt was driving yeah. back. But, but um, <laughs> that was with me and Dalton. I guess we were driving out and uh, we saw these cows and me and Dalton tried to like hit the cows with the machete. And we drove to like, anyways, drove to that one field and we did like donuts and there was like spewing crap shit or like cow shit everywhere. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. fucking! But. Me and Winter were driving, and Winter's actually the one driving. So we're just driving down this curvy ass road, and it started getting into like some real difficult terrain. And I'm not talking about like a bumpy road. I'm talking about like um, curves that are almost vertical, like hills that you have to drive through this little valley. And Winter basically went too far up one of the curves, and it locked the wheel on top of it, and we just flipped. We just flipped like we flipped over once, and I'm not even joking. We fell for about five feet, and we just slammed down. And if me and Winter weren't wearing our seatbelts, we probably would have, like, broke our necks or something because it was a long drop. And, like, me and Winter are, like, upside down. And um, we're upside down, and I, like, unhook myself and, like, fall down, like, four feet. And there's, like, oil pouring all over our heads. And me and Winter are all, like, scratched up and shit. And we, like, eventually flip over the doom buggy. Or the doom buggy. 
and uh, we can't get it started and we realize that there um there's like this starter spray that we had to get it going and we had somehow lost it in the crash so we couldn't get the doom buggy started and eventually um like we let it sit for an hour and it got started again but we got our back we, yeah we got back to my house around six o'clock and the doom buggy kept dying and starting when we were driving down the street back to my house Oh my god! It was I remember crazy. it was after me, uh, me and you had sat there for like hours trying to fix that shit one night. Yeah, um, the entire frame was bent to the left. Like <laughs> me and Winter like went through a shitty ass car crash in this little doom buggy. <laughs> like I'm surprised we didn't kill ourselves. We yeah, but we died. meant to. We, we should have died. Happy All honesty, weekend. we should have died that day. <laughs> we like we literally. Um, we could have been gone for like, I don't know, we were supposed to only be gone for like four hours. We were gone for like six or seven. And my phone didn't have service, and this little radio that we had that was like contacted my dad, it was dead. So we're just out here in the middle of nowhere, and we finally get back to my house. And uh, I had to like wash my dark green gamer hat that got uh, freaking oil all over it. So, yeah. Winter, my, st my uh, dark green gamer hat still has oil splotches on the inside. <laughs> Oh, dude, that was, was terrible. Was, like the rainwater washed it out. And it was like just like a tiny yeah. drop, and we almost fell back into that because like the doom buggy couldn't make it up. Yeah, dude, that was crazy. <laughs> so bad, uh, dude. That doom buggy took me everywhere. I had so much fun that little thing <laughs> until it died. <laughs> yeah, I'm until sorry. it died. <laughs> me and Winter killed it. Yeah, me and Winter killed it. <laughs> My dad sold it like. uh the beginning of last year for like I don't even know two hundred bucks to someone. <laughs> oh, yeah. What a, yeah, man, another like good moment. This is like me, Dalton, and Winter though. It's a destiny thing. It was yeah. like when we first tried to. I do swear to God, raid, if you say it's Trials of Osiris, I'm done. No, 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 no. <laughs> that first time we tried to do a raid, but we were very unprepared for it <laughs> and we couldn't do shit we had to have people like fucking come in and just take us through it because we couldn't kill a single thing once we got to a certain point so that we were kind of just fun. sitting in the back the the and fuck? we were freaking the fuck out no it was a fun like funny moment thing oh it wasn't like it was terrible <laughs> because we couldn't do shit but it was funny also because we couldn't do shit <laughs> any moment, any moment, any moment that I had with you guys on Destiny wasn't fun. It, it was, it was you know, mediocre. Destiny it just was never fun. Game. We fun. tried to do trials, and both all of you guys just fucked up. Dalton was the only one who was actually kind of doing really good. What the fuck are you talking and then Johnny, about? Like, we you, all oh were God. even Completely in trials. Just, no, we weren't. I was dropping headshots across map with my sniper. And Johnny, you yeah, just kept dying. Dalton left and did right. snipers. And I got a good amount of kills every game too. I'm sorry. Good well, moments. Well. Yeah, the good moments I had with like uh, Nathan and Dalton were like playing on that Minecraft server. Because okay. yeah, for the first time Nathan finally got me to buy Minecraft, and Dalton bought it on the same day as me, and uh, we started playing on this server that we created. It, it was so much fun. Like we played on it for almost an entire year, and oh yeah, it was just I had a lot of fun on that server. That Minecraft server with Nathan it was cool. Nathan? I thought that was me. Yeah. No, that was Nathan. It's a Minecraft server on the computer. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and Psycho, we even got Psycho to play with us for a bit. That was cool. What was that one map we built with all the towers? Mm, I don't know. James, you remember that map that we started with Matt? Like, the, the one that we've had? That we Man. had the ones up the diamonds on it? Yeah, the mansion's up on the hill. Yeah. I still have that. <clears throat> <laughs> it was like our very first actual big creative map that we had. When the I don't know. Some glitches out on Minecraft on Xbox. Oh, you mean my map? I thought it was. It, it, thought, it was called Matt's map. I thought it was. I thought Dalton had it. Uh, I don't know. And I built like that giant ass subway that went across the map, and all my football fields. Oh. Oh, that. Yeah, that was the first map I ever played on. That was the first map we all played on together when it first came out. Yeah, I dude, our house too. was so yeah. Oh. That house was so janky. I still have that one too. It's made out of diamonds. Like, yeah. <laughs> Fucking. Uh, oh my god. Nostalgia. I oh my god. I, <laughs> I remember I pissed Dalton off because I finally got it on the Xbox and I went the down. The Monte like, Carlo. Find diamonds in like five minutes to find diamonds. Oh. The Monte Carlo. Ah, uh, that's the one with all the towers. We we built skyscrapers, and it was called the Monte Carlo because it was on. We thought it was the other side of the map. Actually, it was only like five minutes away from where we actually were. 
I figured that out. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, All right. yeah, it was like a resort place. We had like a huge hotel and a bunch of skyscrapers and like huge farmlands. My football yeah. fields. <laughs> yeah, that was cool. Woo. So, All right, well, I think everyone did their best and worst moments. Uh, Nathan, did you? No, I actually... Oh, do you want to go? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Sorry, I, me, I, I was nostalgic, you know? <laughs> no, it's cool. I was doing, doing my own, dealing with my own shit right now, so it's cool. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Mike. Uh, but, um, good moments. Fuck, dude. I definitely think some of the good moments was um, when we first started doing videos together and just oh yeah it, dude i started uh gang life roleplay with you yeah we we me and you fucking started that shit and i i think that was me and you were the first people to Dalled we were up with that <laughs> yeah. yeah yeah it was like the first two episodes was just me and nathan and then the second episode uh we finally got dalton to come do it with us nathan's dead yeah what <laughs> yeah nathan got killed in liberty city yeah. <laughs> Dalton killed Nathan. It broke me up. <laughs> it broke me up. To. I need to yeah, become I was a gonna... mass murderer of you guys. Yeah, I was going to kill myself on the series because Nathan was gone. <laughs> I ended um, up killing. I ended up shooting Matt in the head and shooting Winter in the no, heart. You shoot was... Matt in the head. No. You shot, yeah. like, the You shot in someone the in the face and they ended up living. Yeah, I shot Matt and I shot Winter in the heart. And then I ended up, you guys were doing a convoy mm. thing, and I ambushed you guys. And then you yeah. guys took me, yeah, and then you no. guys, yeah, yeah I watched yeah, it did. today. And then you guys took uh. me to this room and beat the living shit out of me. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was great, dude. I forgot yeah, we, we came back. Fridge, man, that's so sad. <laughs> we're <getting> actually, <laughs> I just remembered another good moment was actually when we were doing the role play. That wasn't too bad. Yeah. We had a couple good moments. I mean, it was well, mostly no, for me. me it was fun. Besides the point of Matthew abusing all of us. Yeah. Well, you know, <laughs> that was as you guys it wasn't like that in the early days. Yeah, I think yeah. once we got more people and we were starting to hard, do more complex dude. things, it was just harder to do to dude, like, keep everybody on point. Matt, me and you literally went just we 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 went off of fucking base shit we just fucking like winged it and we're just like you know what? we're just yeah. gonna fucking wing this episode let's just fucking we winged the first two episodes no the first <laughs> episode was winged that to that series was legendary <laughs> what oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> Dude, the intro was fucking... just i picked on that josh kid <laughs> yeah that was just... what is it fuck um... that, like, uh, we had a lot of good like, moments uh, <laughs> Dude, like, I think the early days of the roleplay were the best, because it was kind of just yeah. all improv, like... It was really simple. It was the trailer. <laughs> I think the it trailers just... were, like, the funnest oh, things dude. to do. <laughs> the, um, the very last trailer, I think it was, like, uh, Blood Empire or something like that. I really liked that one. That one was really cool. Yeah. And, uh, the one trailer where we left it on, like, a, uh, uh cliffhanger where, like, Dalton's gonna get shot by Johnny, oh, that was great. That got people so hyped to see the next season. Dude, that was amazing. And I love how we, like, made that work, too. Like, yeah. Because to be honest, like, when we did that one, we had nothing planned for what was gonna come at the end of the season. Like, we kind of yeah. were just like, oh, this will look cool in the trailer. So we did that. Yeah. And then we got to the second season, we're like, shit, how do we, like, tie this in? Like, and then, fuck. what is it? My candy. That fucking candy that I always ate and that just gave me great ideas and out of nowhere. I'm just like, oh my god, we could do this. And then you're just like, yes. <laughs> Don't forget the and times that he it. yelled at you for eating. Yeah, oh, but then he crunches. apologized because that candy gave us some of the some good fucking ideas. Yeah. Like every time I wrote a script for the uh for the trailers, I was eating that candy. <laughs> it was so good. Oh my god. That that fucking candy. Every time I find I that, candy, that candy, I buy like six flavor. bags of that. Probably do. They What's actually up? have gummy dicks you can send to people. Mm. Like, they're called <laughs> bag of dicks. Um, you can send them to someone, and it comes a little card that says, Here, eat a bag of dicks. And they're little good. gummy dicks. But so, fucking... James, uh, do you have anything to add to, like, your best moments, worst moments? Mm. Of a three-year friendship with, like, me or any of, uh, anyone else in here? Well, it hasn't been even three years. Uh, it's been, like, ten. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mm. Me and Dalton and James' friendship started when we were about, like, Two years old, <laughs> or at least I was two. They were like four, or three, or something like that. Yeah, like I can go way, way back, or Come I can go back, <laughs> or I can go to back when it was began with the three of us. 
You mean like playing GTA or GTA, MW3. <laughs> Good stuff. Had a lot of fun doing that. Black Ops 2. Black Ops 1. Yeah. I don't remember really playing Black Ops 1 that much. All we did was zombies. Yeah. But other than that, that was oh, it. Yeah. Usually, I'm usually a peaceful one. I don't like fighting. Uh, back then, you did. You did. It's just crazy yeah. that we started off okay. with three of us, and now there's like seven, eight. Okay. Yeah, I know. It Isn't is. that insane? Like, it only took us four years, uh, or maybe f about four years to get another, like, I don't know, four members. Yeah. Like, when I remember when I got into here, me, Dalton, and James got into, like, an argument. <laughs> <laughs> like every other day about something but it was mainly like james and then me and dalton <laughs> like that no. fucking that one about like fucking uh the shootings and <laughs> where the, that was the stupidest thing we ever got yeah there, argument over. so there was a story about some like black kid that got shot and they were trying to fit uh, james was on the side that the cops shouldn't be punished it wasn't his fault and dalton and james or dalton like, and johnny what? yeah dalton <laughs> Dalton and Johnny were on the side that the kid did nothing wrong. And they basically fought each other out. And not, like, not voice fighting. I mean, like, text fighting for, like, hours. Yeah, it was, like, it was bad. It was so bad. It was just back and forth. It His was name like, was oh, Michael really? Brown. What's your I fucking think. proof? <laughs> <laughs> Michael Brown. Psycho. Psycho's just like, just so you know. No, it's not a little black kid. It's Michael Brown. And what was it? Yeah, that was just kind of just one of the stupidest moments we ever had. Was It was just... All of, like, Matt, Winter, and Psycho were kind of just not in it. They were quiet, and it was me and yeah. Dalton just fighting the fuck with James. Me and Psycho would egg it on. We're like, yeah, fuck you, or no. <laughs> we just keep I it said going. I an oversized nigger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but me and Psycho, me and Psycho would just commentate the fight and, like, keep people getting pissed off at each other. It was always fun. Oh, my God. And, yeah, I think pretty much we've had more good moments than bad. Yeah. I've had well, more if bad you go... moments than good. Yeah. I mean, if you look on you me and Dalton and James's... You make me have bad <laughs> That's moments. true, Winter. You you do fight with us a lot. I but, I mean, when I, I think me... Fighting, you have the funnest time ever here, just like everyone else. <laughs> I have a fun time, just not a lot of times. <laughs> I think, like, me, Dalton, and... Uh, James have had like the darkest past because literally we would get into a fight on Xbox over GTA pretty oh, much yeah. every day. Like every single day would be a fight. Well, that's how like most games ended is we would play Grand Theft Auto and then we would end up fighting and then just stop playing Grand Theft Auto. Yeah. And then we'd do the next thing the very next day. Fine. Just like, oh, hey, how you doing? Yeah. I know we were just um, fighting yesterday and I called you a faggot, but what's up? <laughs> <laughs> but we'll definitely All right. have fun, um, um, in the upcoming months, um, when yeah, uh, the if James gets his X, yeah, dude, if James gets his thing. Xbox, it'll be amazing. Nathan gets his Xbox sooner or later. The new zombie Easter egg crew. Yeah. No, honestly, I think this is the the first time we've all actually been together again in a like while. A fucking I think since. The, yeah, I was gonna say the last time almost all of us got together when was when we did like a meeting or something like that. Oh yeah, I remember that. Everyone, yeah, it's everyone. Yeah, except like this Dark Knight Razor and all those people but, that I don't. Yeah, know. except <laughs> Dark Knight Razor doesn't even talk to us. Yeah, except for Razor, and uh, I guess technically Psycho's little brother is part of the clan, but he's not really like a part a part of the clan. He just likes to tag. Yeah, <laughs> he's running shit over there on the PS4. Dark Knight Razor on the PlayStation Four. Huh? Razor's on the PlayStation Four. Oh, he is. Oh wow. Damn. So well, did I Razor think we need a new talk? topic. Because whenever I played with him, I don't think he ever talked. Yeah, he did. It was two of them who played on the account, and it was his brother and then his friend. Or it was two brothers, and like one of them we liked, and the other one we didn't really care it's for. Hugo that we liked, right? <laughs> Hugo, that's his name. Yeah. Don't ever Hugo mention the name Hugo right there. Kid that we didn't like. Yeah. He saw my emblem before, Nathan. Yeah, I remember that. He stole your Spooder Man emblem. <laughs> <laughs> Don't was yeah. stealing phase member emblems and shit. Her name is North, North Korea. Korea and China. <laughs> yeah. Do you guys remember my Kim Jong Un uh, oh my emblem? <laughs> no that was great. Yeah. So uh, it was do you guys like it was like next topic or not? Nah? It was like a shitty face of him, and it had like cum all over it. And it said I heard fags. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> 
Anyways, yeah, we'll go into yeah, another been on topic. This topic a while. Uh, Someone want to pick one since uh, I'll pick one. Second, well, second pick's the last one. Yeah, go ahead, Nathan. Uh, so for Wait. those people who <clears throat> live stream, uh, what is your favorite part about it? Ooh. So that's mainly goes out for well, me, uh, Dalton, and Matt. Right, I think yeah. that's the only three people and who stream me. here. <laughs> <laughs> you wish, motherfucker. <laughs> So um, wh whoever has like the most experience. Let's go with Dalton because well I've I would say Nathan you have the most experience, but um, Dalton recently started live streaming and I think um, just a couple of days ago he had like his actual first turnout where he had like a lot of people in his live stream like oh, actively really? talking and yeah. yeah it was really cool. That's nice. Yeah, there's always that one like guy that's making like weird sexual comments. Johnny. Johnny keeps yeah. Johnny likes to go in Dalton's live stream and be like, "Show us your boobs. <laughs> Show us your tits, Show us your man." Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what was, what was that fucking that first time? Your first live stream? I was just like, "Oh my god, I love you and your videos." Like, yeah. <laughs> and then and then a little bit later on, you were like digging in the dirt, and I was like, "Yeah, you dig that dirt, you hard working <laughs> dirty man." <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, I was scared. Yeah, I was in Dalton's first live stream. I think where he got like a good turnout. He had like seven yeah, people had, in there. Like seven or eight people watching. Yeah, in yeah, yeah. like it's actually pretty fun when that happens. Yeah, when you have when you do a live stream where like everyone's actively commenting and like enjoying what you're doing, that's the, that's the best. Oh my god, I love that. Is there um, anything else you really like about Dalton other than the active talking of people? Um, I don't know. It's just it's really chill. Like you don't have to worry about like doing much. You just play. Yeah, you don't have to worry about like pressing play and making sure both audios are recording, or at least for me. <laughs> um, about it too is that it's just always going, and like sometimes yeah. like, drop random beast stuff happening, and I'm like, oh my god, that should have been recorded. And I'm like, oh wait a second, <laughs> <laughs> I'm live streaming, <laughs> and also yeah. it, it saves onto like a private drive onto your, uh, onto your uh, uh, Elgato. Twitch account, Elgato or or, Elgato or, or, Twitch or on account. Twitch, yeah, on Twitch. So Matt, yeah. why, why don't you go next? Um. My favorite part about live streaming is, like I said, interacting with fans. And my okay, this is one thing I fucking hate about it. I'm like, hey guys, we're gonna play some fucking Battlefield Hardline because it just came out. Oh my god, there's a crocodile. When's Life in Los Santos coming out? Like, oh my fucking god. <laughs> I remember watching you do that, and then it, oh. there's just like this one kid in the fucking chat. He's like. When's Life in Los Santos gonna come out? Oh, yeah. Just like, oh my he's god. He's playing Battlefield Hardline. What? Yeah. Are you serious? Let him enjoy pissed, the game. Yeah, that <laughs> pissed me off so much. And, like, I have to be polite and be like, yeah, man, whatever. Like, it's coming next week or something. But, oh my god, that was the worst yeah. part. You know, because those are fans that not even, like, support your page or anything yeah. like along the lines of that. But yeah, they're like, oh, thanks for the quick update. Bye. And then they just leave. But I <laughs> but like it's... having active people who are like, in the chat, like talking about what I'm doing, um, that's my favorite. Oh, you know, what, what was the most viewers you've ever kind of had? The most viewers I think I ever had was like 35, maybe. Was I? I was monitoring the chat when that happened, right? Wait, Probably. Can I give a spoiler? Yeah. Go. Okay, so. Spoiler for what? Wait for what? Life in Los Santos. Uh. This is not a big one. Okay. Is it about Dalton? No. Okay, then go ahead. Someone died. Dalton's in my basement. <laughs> 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 what? Are, that was the weirdest, like, cringe ever. Like, <laughs> I'm dying. Um, so for oh, those oh. who made it this far in, um, I'm gonna die yeah. in the series. Just letting you know. I'm not gonna die. Since I sold GTA, I'm not gonna be able to play. Well, he's not gonna die, but he's definitely not gonna be alive. I mean, we're gonna brutally. Injure <laughs> what? What does that even mean? He's not gonna die, but he's not gonna be alive. So what well, is I that? Mean, I, I don't understand. <laughs> Nathan, we're going to pull a Nathan, okay? You're going to go off to Liberty pull City, and then Dalton's going to go and kill Winter. Like, we're, yeah, we're pulling a Nathan. <laughs> it's amazing oh if anyone um, watched the video this far. In. Yeah, this far. There's, like, some diehard fans if they made it this far. Oh, yeah. If you made it this far, like, w put whatever the timestamp is right now. That that way we know who, like, the who, like, the hardcore fans are. Uh, I, if I get a... I love those times, most of the t sometimes when we when we talk to those fans, <sighs> and they can remember like all the little shit from like uh -huh. gang life and all that crap from like the beginning. Oh, Have you watched Gang Life? No, uh, I I just started though. Yeah, sometimes you get those uh, kids who are like, yeah. oh no, we just started watching with Life in Los Me Santos. and Johnny, yeah, me and Johnny have had a couple situations where we're like, 
oh, hey, man, how you doing? And he's like, oh, and like, super fanboy and going, like, crazy. And he's like, dude, guess what I'm doing right now? And I was like, what? And he's like, I'm driving the exact car you drove in this video at this timestamp. I'm also wearing the same clothes you were wearing. I'm also using the same guns and the same attachments. It's like, oh, my God. Oh, we got those people that, like, for some reason, they, they think it's okay to, like, watch your video while they're talking while you're, to you. Yeah. Mm, I hate like, that. Just so you know, we're fans. Here's your video. <laughs> Yeah. Would you like to listen to yourself like, through a shitty Xbox 360 yeah. mic? Okay, here you go. And to be honest, one of my topics that I was going to bring up but I didn't write down was, like, the, the whole privacy thing with the fans. Mm. Like, your fans are great. Don't get me wrong. Like, when we talk to them, I like meeting your fans when I used to interview people and all that crap. It's awesome. But then you get those <laughs> those few people who just constantly, like, message us. And they're just like, oh... Can we get in your party? Can we do this? What are you guys doing? You want to play? Come on. Fucking come on, skull come on, master. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my god. And I don't mind that to a sense. But <laughs> you guys got to like, you guys got to remember that like the, we have our our times too when we're just gaming. We're not making videos or anything. Yeah. This is kind of just like there are certain things our that we talk time about to play that with we the don't clan. want like random people to hear. So yeah. We're in a yeah. game like that, and we don't tell you guys that you that you can come in and we're doing something where you guys can come in then just yeah. leave it be because <laughs> <laughs> we understand yeah. you guys love matt and all this shit and <clears throat> dalton's getting big now but like it's kind of it's nice to know that you guys love us enough to keep texting us and be like oh can we play with you but it's also at the same time it's got to like dim down a little bit <laughs> no one texts me anymore which is kind of good <laughs> I had this uh, this one person who always every day he was just like, "Hey, how are you? How's Matt doing? How's Winter?" It was Aww. it was nice, but no it was also shit like, about me. "Oh, dude!" You're dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! You're dead to us. You're dead. <laughs> I sent Dalton to kill you. Remember you call yeah. him? Actually, you know, Nathan, I, that's like a question I have for you though. Like, do you consider yourself Dark Rain? Because I don't see you like identifying as Dark Rain on any like gaming or anything like that. Well, like, I do. I've always, I've always wanted to like change my gamer tag on Xbox back to Dark Rain Famous, but I've never really had the time. It's just like, you no, I was talking about for like PC. Like you, you, like you've been having like super random names, but you haven't had like Dark Rain Famous since like we played Minecraft, like on Steam. On Steam, well, like you know, it's on Steam. I, no one really knows who I am because I'm very absent from the game. dark your your channel in the dark uh, rain yeah. scene because i'm like I, I'm, I'm kind sure. of like an antigo person i'm sure people know who you are just not as much as they know who like johnny or winner is oh yeah totally like i'm just a very indigo person do, uh due to like just like the whole entire it, it, just the whole situation and it's just like <sighs> what the fuck what's the going fuck? on <laughs> what the fuck johnny are you okay what what the we fuck know that dude? Was you <laughs> What are you talking about? Johnny? That just sounded like you just squirted all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> just leaked a little bit of titty milk. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and, you know, like, it's mainly my fault because I'm just a lazy piece of shit. And, you know, I constantly oh have god. things going on and just, you know, like... Yeah. Well, that leads me into Dalton's topic that he has on here, which, like, uh... Johnny, Johnny, fuck you. Fuck <laughs> Alright, go ahead. Uh, anyways... This is one of Dalton's topics, which was uh, recruiting new clan members for like PS or PS4. Not maybe not so much PS4 because none of us have it, but like I'll PC buy one. basically. <laughs> I'll buy one. I'll buy one. <laughs> hey, I can buy, buy one. Break it. My Xbox is broken, so why not? Wow. But yeah, so recruiting clan members for the PC. I don't know if that'd work because like the leaders of the main clan are on xbox yeah that's what i was thinking i was just thinking that right now like how would that work i mean like hey i'm the only oh. other pc uh player on dark rain clan come join me do nothing because, oh my like, god what a bit <laughs> <laughs> like it's kind of with the whole pc thing just back like a good moment gmod oh, oh my yeah. god i oh, fucking shit. love that so Dude, you guys remember playing the scary maps? <laughs> <laughs> the yeah. beginning when I was like fucking right. Batman, Dalton was Obama. <laughs> and then yeah, I was just I remember... like some fucking anime character. Yeah, I remember, I think I was Homer or um... You were a Doctor Who. Yeah, 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 Doctor Who. Yeah, Doctor Who or Homer. And then you were Matt Smith. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, oh, I remember that. <laughs> that was great. I just yeah. got like, Nathan bought me 
Gary's mod just because my laptop was able to run it. Because he yeah. didn't think it would be able to, and then he like saw it, and he was like, well, damn, and then he bought it for me. Well, damn. <laughs> yeah, basically, like, we're all playing Gary's mod, and James was, or, not James, sorry, uh, Johnny's like, I want to play, and Nathan's like, send me your specs real quick, and Nathan, or, James sent, or, Johnny sent Nathan a picture, and Nathan's like, all right, I'm going to gift this to you real quick, like, just gift him a fucking $20 game, like, out of nowhere. It was like eight bucks, though. It was on sale for, like, oh, yeah, it, was, it was on sale uh, for two bucks, so. Oh, never mind. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that was when, like, Nathan had just bought, like, Fucking fifty dollars worth of shit. Yeah. I bought you guys fifty dollars worth of shit. No, like Not you me. had gotten like, fifty dollar <laughs> gift cards or whatever. Oh, I had two hundred dollars. I had yeah. two hundred dollars from Christmas. Yeah. I was gonna say you didn't give me no fucking fifty dollars <laughs> worth of shit. I got. Yeah, I was, was on like, the down low. He bought me fifty dollars worth of shit. <laughs> no, I think I just yeah, got Johnny that. like. I think I just got Johnny like a single game, didn't I? Yeah, you yeah. bought me Gary's mom. Yeah, I and I think it. you were you were debating on whether or not to oh. buy Dalton Arma or whatever the fuck it was. I think it was I bought either Arma. Matt, I think I yeah I bought Dalton Arma. I was gonna buy John or Johnny. No, wait, I, got, I uh, think I got it for Dalton as well. Uh, fucking Gary's mod. I don't know. Yeah, you wait. Me something. Yeah, I, I did. I did get. It. Yeah. I did. I did. Yeah, and then we all played <laughs> yeah. together. Yeah. Well, um, I remember. I think I got Dalton Arma, and then I got uh. Johnny, uh, what's it called? H one Z one. Matt, you bought me, you bought me Arma, and I thought you bought me Vegas. I think I did. Did you buy me H one Z one? I think I did. <laughs> Hold on. I think you were debating on it because I, I remember you were about to because I was just because I kept telling you I was gonna buy it and then I never did. Then you were like, <laughs> you know, I'm getting really close to just buying it for you. <laughs> And that might have been it then. Yeah, and then I fucking I bought it because I remember. I bought I bought Nathan H one Z one. I bought three other. I've, okay, so in my H one Z one career, I bought five copies, and I've probably spent like more than five hundred bucks in crates. Jesus so, Christ! <laughs> yeah, I've spent too much money on a oh, twenty dollars. Oh, dude, I just remember this. Do you remember when we tried starting the uh, fucking Sintro three co op? Oh God, no! We got like six Shit. episodes fucking going, and then we just stopped at. First episode. Yeah. Saints Row 4! Oh, yeah, I remember that. Jesus Christ. I have so many failed series <laughs> on my channel. It was 40 minutes. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Snipe off Sundays. Oh, that was cool. Sni oh, Sni remember story time? <laughs> oh, yeah. Did anyone else remember that? Yeah. I remember Winter was doing this stupid glitch where, like, the, the face would come off. For the character. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Psycho's fucking OG. If you remember Snipe Off Sundays, he's OG as fuck. Like, oh my god. <laughs> Yo, Storytime was like, I think that, that was like one of your most popular videos that you uploaded. At the time, yeah. yeah before time. I started doing like, yeah, gang life and stuff. Yeah, and then the next one was fucking... Thunderclap. God, <laughs> fucking thunderclap. And then like, <sighs> what, what episode was I on, on in on GTA 5 Online with Friends? Um, you did like season one, episode nine. You came back for like a little bit, and then you just left. No, it. like GTA online, G GTA online with friends. Oh yeah, I don't know. I think you're on with like one or two. I think I'm on episode two. two. Yeah. Anyways, <laughs> I think we should find a new topic. Uh, someone wanna? Oh, actually, I oh, wait, think you I never had put one your there. input on on uh, what you thought of uh, streaming. Streaming. Oh, I did. Yeah, I said did. that I liked it. Yeah. That, that's it. You said yeah. the fans <laughs> comment. I liked it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but I never put my input. <laughs> I feel like... This is literally one of Dalton's topics. How shitty Xbox One because it's really <laughs> shitty. <laughs> they had <laughs> Wait, what? It's fucking... <laughs> <laughs> it's so Dalton. <laughs> Dalton. <laughs> How shitty is the Xbox One because it's really shitty? <laughs> How <laughs> shitty is crazy. Xbox One because it's really shitty, guys? Yeah. We have a ton um, of trouble on, on Call of Duty. Oh, like, yeah. Connecting to one another. Like, Winter can't connect to Dalton. Dalton can't if, connect to Winter. I can't connect dude, to Psycho. Psycho can't if connect to... me and Dalton could connect to each other, <laughs> we would make it to round 50 on the fucking okay. map. Winter, imagine if you had me and, like, James I'm or Psycho. For them. We make it around like eighty. <laughs> I like Dalton's third quite or third topic. Yeah. Dark Rain some a uh, dark rain merch. Yeah, dude, we should totally get some dark rain T-shirts and you hats said going. Should set a merc. Hey, shut the fuck up. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, dark rain T-shirts. The merch. Dude, 
Dude, I'll be fucking representing you at fucking school, dude. dude I'd, be like, who the I'd fuck is that, like, dark red dark red gamer? <laughs> like, um, I told you guys, oh, like, a lot... <laughs> I told you guys already that I had a dark red gamer hat for a while. Everyone knows that. Dude, let's get some but, um, dark red letterbed jackets. I, the thing is, like... Do you guys even think... When I stop, oh my god. Do you guys even think that, like, people would buy t-shirts and hoodies and stuff? I think like, people would. I honestly do. Well, the problem is, like, um, you have to pay just to even have them made. So you're probably... If we put in, like, 200 bucks and we only get, like, 150, you're not, you know, not making a profit. Not only that, but you're not even breaking even. Why don't you just... Oh, yeah, true. Hold it down. Like, you just fucking make a video about well, like, it. Sometime. Yeah, like... See make... what people have to think. Like, see how many people are willing to buy it and then just go off of But that. then again, there are some people that say they will get it, but then yeah, they but just they end up not doing it. Yeah. But I think we should just start off by, like, making merchandise for ourselves that's what i was saying yeah. like, 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 I'm, and, like yeah if everyone puts in like i don't know 10 bucks towards us we could totally get a like little shirt campaign if going. you send me your pinnacle i could uh i could uh input like 10 20 dollars yeah well that's what i was saying like if we could like get everyone to pay like at least like 10 bucks we could totally get some merchandise going like, yeah totally even yeah. not even if we have to sell it, but just for ourselves. I'm like, saying, I'm, I think hoodies. Knows, everyone like. Dude, everyone I would here love it like, <laughs> if we got t-shirts <laughs> saying like "Winter is my favorite uh, oh. clan member" or something like that. <laughs> like Nathan is a big piece of shit. From, uh, <laughs> Nathan is dead. <laughs> Nathan's dead. He's not even here anymore. Just guys. in big bold words that appeared yesterday. Nathan, Nathan is dead. You're dead. <laughs> Nathan, Nathan, you're dead. dead. <laughs> Yeah. And then you just... <laughs> Fuck's sake. But, like, a Dark Rain hoodie, I imagine it being, like... So, um, those of you who, like, follow my Instagram, you could see uh, the last picture that I posted. And it was, like... Not the one, but... Okay. It's the last picture I posted, I think, was the Dark Rain uh, emblem. I mean, it's like a little badge. It's like a shield, actually. Oh, and yeah. I think I it looks it. really cool. But we're, when we, um, I asked everyone, I was like, what do you, when you think of Dark Rain, what do you think, like, what color do you think of? And everyone said, like, Dark blue. darkish blue. Yeah. So, we could do, like, a dark blue t-shirt with, like, white writing that says, like, dark rain and then, like, Rolo and with the two chicks, you know? We have to get all get together and work. No one even knows what Rolo stands yeah. for. Not even we know. It, but... Roll one light one? We just wanted to be unique. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Bro, uh, Fucking, roll of ludicrous objects, which is my favorite. Always. Fruit roll-ups. <laughs> what is it? Fruit Matt, we need to get a shirt. <laughs> that oh, it says, he ain't got no pants. <laughs> <laughs> they ain't got no pants. No, they ain't got, they ain't no, got pants. no pants. Uh, oh my god, that was great. It's an oh. inside joke. To me. Yeah, <laughs> that's an inside joke for people who are watching. Um, huh? ludicrous repping objects. Repping our ludicrous Ooh. objects. Yeah, repping our Ooh. ludicrous objects. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Now what I would do about the t-shirts, oh. I would just get them for us for now. Yeah. And then later. I, I want sweatshirts. T-shirts oh, are want... cool, but sweatshirts are more usable. Yeah. Exactly. Thank you. Finally, someone understands. Like, there yeah, was one who like, why do you always have sweatshirt. so many sweatshirts? I'm like, because, like, what if I, I, I always like wearing sweatshirts, and they, you could wear them a lot more, a lot longer, and no one will yeah. question about it. But, like, if you wear a t-shirt for, like, two days in the same week, they're like, why'd you wear that shirt again? I'm like, <laughs> well, I fucking washed it. Do you have a problem with it, sir? <laughs> But like with Crazy the sweatshirt, they don't really question it because like it's sweatshirts. So I'm like, yeah. you know, I'm like gonna get multiple sweatshirts. Hoodies. All right. Pullovers yeah, uh, are my favorite. Swe uh, sweatshirt is a hoodie, basically. That's what we're talking about. We're talking about hoodies. Like we want to get some dark rain hoodies. You guys like zip ups or pullovers? Zip and if if we're gonna make custom ones okay. just for us, we could put like dark rain, and then we could put like raids and havoc, and then fa uh, famas, and then like void. You know, winter or chaos. I'm changing mine from chaos to whatever. Winter. Yeah. Yeah, you have to be dark rain winner. <laughs> yeah. No one like whenever everyone sees darker chaos, like who the fuck is that? Like they don't know that it's winner. <laughs> but uh, no, 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 no. Matt, you you know my Instagram <laughs> username used to be fucking dark rain famous for the longest time. Oh, uh, it was. I didn't yeah, know. <laughs> you didn't know that? It was it used to no. be dark rain famous for like the longest time. I I always thought it was for boss, <laughs> like the gun from Black Ops. <laughs> oh, it is. My it snap it is? Okay. Yeah, it's my uh, favorite okay. weapon. Dark rain. Because I thought you were trying to like put a spin on the word famous, because <laughs> the way you keep saying it is famous. It, it that's how you say it. Famous. It's famous. 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 I think it's famous. Yeah. yeah, it's the it's famous. 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 Yo, man, I'm shooting that famous. Famous. Galeli. Galeli. Oh, 
my god. Anyways, uh, we need to find a new topic. Um, how about you know, since some of us, you know, I know Nathan plays guitar. I play okay. saxophone, guitar every now and then. You know, we all have vast ranges of music, and you know, I, 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 I feel like I one of us has some vocals serious in talent marks. in here. Yeah. This is the person and, who wanted to learn how to scream by a fucking shitty ass band. And band sucks. winner, winner can lay down some pretty sick beats. Let's uh, let's, oh, let's uh, let's big rap busy. skills. All right. Yeah. Do I even got a beat for this? Yeah! Hold on, I can play a beat for you if you need one. Fuck you! Yeah. <laughs> 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 We're doing a show! Wait, sir! You need to watch your mouth! I don't give a fuck! I'll do what I want. Free speech. <laughs> yeah. Free speech. Oh Alright, whatever. I will lay a beat down for you. It's not racist, it's a way of religion. Hey. I played the seven. <laughs> Hold on, let me find a beat. KKK is not a religion, buddy. Let me find a beat. Is that like the little playpen things that you just like ting on or whatever? This is actually a guitar. If you fucking... Winner's just got a little ukulele. <laughs> it's not a ukulele, it's a legit electric guitar. Ukulele? Yeah. Although right. I'm not rapping, well, it's like a dick. This part's gonna be probably horrendous, so if it doesn't turn out good, I'll have to cut it out. <laughs> Alright. Hold on one second, let me get a beat for Winner. Alright. Oh, God. <laughs> this better not be copyrighted. All right, we're back. So we had a little uh, recording fuck up on my end, but we're back, and uh, we're basically just gonna do one more topic, and then we're gonna end off uh, darker and downtime. So, um, Johnny, what was the topic again? Um, we're, what oh, do we see in like a future, like uh, next ten, twenty years slash? Uh, if Dark Rain ever gets, gets bigger, bigger, what are our future right. expectations for it and all that crap? So if Dark Rain gets bigger um, yeah. in the next twenty years, what do we what do we think is gonna happen? Uh... Even well, in the next twenty, like next few. Okay, in the next like few years, like five years maybe. I definitely see us yeah. growing, getting more members. I could see like a professional gaming league. Definitely the Dark Rain Manor. That'd be cool. Um, yeah. I could see everyone doing their own little channels and stuff like that. Our merchandise. See, yeah, merchandise. I could see that. Um, I could see the Dark Rain Network becoming like an actual thing like, where people go to get like information and stuff. You know, I don't know. What do you guys think? Yeah, I think everything um, you covered is basically what's gonna happen yeah. in the next. Well, maybe it, years. it might happen, just <laughs> depending on how this oh, goes. Pretty much. I mean, with how like young we all still are, and how Especially much me. like how many fans <laughs> you still actually have. Um. Yeah, I see Dark Rain growing pretty nicely, and yep. not even like seeing it. Just would hope that yeah. we grow nope. more fans, we become bigger. <laughs> like Psycho was saying, um, we want to remind you guys. So, if you want to join Dark Rain, like you think you would totally be like a good friend, or like you you want to join our clan and also be a friend, because like I guess with We're some. Yeah, it's like a family. So, like, for other mm -hmm. clans, it's like, oh, you join our clan, you play for our team, and you do this. But, like, Dark Rain is more of, like, a like a friend group more than a clan. It's, like, everyone gets along with each other moderately. Like, no one really hates each other that much, you know, from time and time again. <laughs> yeah, so we're oh, looking yeah. for, like, a friend. So if you think you could, like, fit that position, put your gamer tag in the description, and we'll, like, hang, you know, invite you to a party or something to hang out with you. No one's sensitive. Um, yeah, if you don't yeah. like people saying like the n word or calling people chinks okay, or yeah, yeah, we like yeah, we, <laughs> when we it's talk all like joking and yeah. good fun, but we do make a lot of like racist jokes, like most fucking friend groups do. Yeah, but we keep it's it in like, like fucking nigger. Yeah, we keep it in our little friend God circle. Nigger. Jesus, <laughs> <laughs> that's like the fourth n word in this show. <laughs> Probably. Oh god. And. Yeah, I think it'd be nice to have new people. Hopefully, grow bigger. But like, just grow bigger, but also stay with who we have at the yeah. moment. So, if you guys think you can fill in that position as like a new friend or something like that, put your uh, gamer tag in the description or in the comments, and uh, we'll pick you out and like message you and hang out with you, see how you are. Interview and, you. Yeah, interview you for a position. <laughs> what do you think our next few videos are going to be about? Internship. Um. 
Well, this video, Dark Rain Downtime, this is going to go up on my channel, which is Dark Rain Gamer. And uh, it's also going to go up on uh, Dark Rain Network, which is our community channel for the Dark Rain Clan. And okay. it's probably going to go up on Dalton's channel if he wants it. So, yeah. yeah. And by the way, everyone, uh, Dalton's channel is uh, X-Ray Raids. So, it's spelled just like how Dark Rain is, lowercase, uppercase, you know. So, yeah. I think that's pretty much it. It was really cool having all seven of us in a Skype call together. Hey, oh, Nathan look, Nathan joined yeah, back. Man. For the last couple of seconds. <laughs> huh? Oh, we're about to end this off. <laughs> oh. But yeah, <laughs> it was cool having all seven of us together, even though uh, Dalton had to go do whatever he went to go do. So. Yeah. Matt, I just realized that the controller in your Skype picture looks exactly like the controller I have. It's an Xbox One controller. <laughs> it's a white Xbox One controller. <laughs> yeah, but it said <laughs> yeah. my D-pad is gold. Oh. Oh. Fab. Wow. Fabulous. Well, now I have to go change mine to top yours. It's going to be like magenta or some shit. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want more videos like this, make sure to like, but, you know, say so in the comments. So we uh, like this motherfucker. Yeah, like this motherfucker. Uh, give us yeah. feedback. Right. Feedback and yeah. So see you later, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.